Now we're going to the better parts of our service, which is, our, the, which is the word. Saints, let's all follow along. Pay attention. Not, let, let our minds go to far off place. There's no way you should be thinking about pandas, kangaroos, or tigers. And let's all stay in the word and recharge our spiritual batteries. Saints, I'm not going to prolong the time. We have our beloved... Pastor Riddle to miss. So let's all stand and rise and receive our beloved Pastor Riddle. I say and praise Yahweh. Amen. Praise Yahweh, saints. Y'all may be seated. But we thank Yahweh for allowing us to be here this morning, giving double honor to the bishops that we have. Pastor Washington, who's preaching to the, ministering to the saints of Mexico. Amen. Thank Yahweh for the ministry. Keep going forth to them down there. But we also thank Yahweh for the word that's about to come forth. Amen. I do thank Yahweh for the family that I do have in his way. My mom and my sister and my nephew being here with us this morning. Amen. And I always thank Yahweh for the word because he's made a way for me in this life. He's the one who changed my life and I owe my life unto him now. Amen. I am in debt to the church. Hallelujah. Amen. Because our, our life was bought with a price. Amen. But we know that we do have our beloved Evangelist Childers in the midst. Amen. Yahweh, he's going to be using him this morning and to bring forth the word. And we know that the men that Yahweh's anointed amongst us are led of the Holy Ghost. So I ask that you prepare your heart, prepare your mind, make sure you have your Bibles out, and you're following along with the man of God. But at this time, I'm not going to prolong the time. Let us all please stand and receive our beloved Evangelist Childers. By saying, praise Yahweh. Praise Yahweh. Amen. Praise Yahweh, saints. Praise Yahweh. Praise Yahweh. Yahweh. Is Yahweh good? Is Yahweh good? Glory be to Yahweh. Rejoice. Rejoice. Amen. You may be seated. Amen. I miss that about Mother Brenda. That remind me of Mother Brenda so much. Amen. Sure, I want to thank Yahweh for being in his house one more time. We thank God for my life, health, and strength. Give a double honor to the men of God that labor in this way. Of course, all the apostles, all the evangelists, all the pastors. Amen. Yes. The teacher. Amen. Amen. We, the Bible said through out of a multitude of counselors, there's safety. Yes. Amen. And I want to thank Yahweh for the word that comes forth from this place. Amen. Amen. It truly is right on time every yes. time. Yes, Amen. Even when... Yeah, I don't care what it's talking about. It's, it, it, it's going to find you. Hallelujah. Amen. Because only Yahweh knows the life that you're living. That's right. Amen. Only Yahweh knows the things that you do in the dark and in the secret. Amen. Amen. Yeah. Amen. And, and, and somebody said, Yahweh's a tattletale. Because <laughs> 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 he'll tell on you. <laughs> Amen. Yeah. Amen. But the truth is, uh, uh, he hates evil. Yeah. Amen. The truth is, he hates sin. Amen. And he knows that to get to him, you're going to have to have sin. You have to be sinless. Amen. We can't have one spot, not one wrinkle, not one blemish. Amen. See, the world don't know that. That's how they can go and have God in their mouth and still cuss. Amen. That's how they can go and have God in their mouth and still lie and steal and do all those evil things within their, within their mind and imagination to do. Amen. Amen. But truly, Yahweh has been good to us in this place. I want to thank y'all for my wife making it home safely. Yes. Amen. Truly, um, the, the devil's always trying to come between husband and wives. Yes. Amen. The devil's always trying to destroy that foundation that Yahweh said. He put Adam and Eve yes. together. Amen. At the beginning. Amen. Amen. And, 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 and set them. That's how he wanted it to be. So the devil's always been trying to destroy that ever since. Yes. Amen. Amen. He gave, he gave them the law of divorcement. Amen. Yes. Him trying to separate all of that. But Yahweh always said, I hate to put it away. Amen. 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 You got to love the one that Yahweh has given you. Amen. The scripture says, uh, deal not treacherously with the, the wife of thy youth. Amen. 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 And I thank Yahweh for this place that we know these things. Amen. Amen. That's why the spirit of Michelle said that she got to go back to her husband. Amen. 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 Because any other thing, God hated. Amen. Anything that, yeah, there's no such thing as God want me to be happy. Amen. He does. He wants you to be happy in him. Amen. Doing what he be happy doing what he told you to do. You don't want to be happy. You to be happy with your own flesh and what you want and what you desire. Amen. Another kind of happiness he wants from you. We call to suffer. 
Amen. Michelle has been in that situation for a very long time. Mm -hmm. And only Yahweh can work that out. Amen. Thank Yahweh for Junior calling. Yes. Amen. Thank Yahweh for that. Amen. Sometimes it takes people outside to show them the right way. Amen. Sometimes it takes somebody on the other side. Amen. Somebody that, 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 that's not involved. Amen. To give better counsel than what you've been receiving. Amen. Amen. But in this place, ain't no better counsel than what's in the church. Hallelujah. If you get your counsel from anyone from outside this church, you're wrong. Amen. Amen. Now, if you get counsel about uh, uh, fixing your car tire and how to do that, that's okay. Amen. If you get counsel about, you know, the best way to cook that uh, meatloaf, that's all right. Amen. Amen. How to keep your house a little bit cleaner. That's fine. But when it comes to your eternal soul, you can't take no advice from nobody outside this church. Amen. I know people outside listen and say, that's, that's bold for him to say. Amen. Don't we all got some truth? Yeah, just some. But we walk in the present truth. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. We're, this is the present truth. This is the truth of this generation. Amen. What Yahweh has brought forth for our generation. And if you don't have the apostle, the man of God that Yahweh sent, you have, to be, you have to have a man of God that sent. Amen. Amen. If he's not sent, that means he sent himself. Hallelujah. And there's so many churches out there that done that. Amen. Yes. But I want to call attention to the book of James. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes. Amen. Thank Yahweh for the word that came forth uh, Thursday night. Oh, yeah. Amen. Cleaning up the bishops. Yes. Amen. The bishops don't get away. You think the bishops get away? You can't hide behind a good message. Amen. You can't hide behind a good testimony. You can't hide behind a good song. Because you got to have charity. Amen. I thank Yahweh for, for, for how God, our Yahweh, looks down from heaven and, 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 and he'll send you dreams. Amen. Uh, without the Bible says, without vision, the people will perish. I thank Yahweh for the vision that He has in the church. Amen. Thank Yahweh. Uh, you be doing. Uh, you have a, a plan in your mind or a thought in your mind, and, and just that day, you're like, you know what? Let me just turn on the word real quick. And you turn on the word, and it's right on what you was thinking about, or what you was planning on doing. Amen. Amen. And I thank Yahweh for that. He shows that He's with us all the time. He shows you with us all the time. So when people outside wonder why we ain't looking out, why we, won't, why we don't want to go to their church, why this old church so different, uh, we can say it's come and see. Amen. Amen. Because I can tell you. Amen. But you're going to take it with a grain of salt. You got you to gotta see it for yourself. Amen. Amen. You got to see it for yourself. Amen. Seeing is believing. Amen. Amen. But we're going to call you book to James chapter 2. Amen. Amen. James 2 and 1. James 2 and 1. For it's written. It's written. My brethren. My brethren. Have not faith of our Lord Yeshua the Messiah. Uh-huh. The Lord of glory with respect of person. What? The Lord of glory with respect of person. My brethren, have not the faith of our Lord Yeshua the Messiah. The Lord of glory with respect of person. Amen. Don't you know we could be respected person in this place? Amen. Yahweh's against that respected person. Amen. He's against it. Amen. Amen. He likes a just balance. Amen. Amen. That's why you can't be racist in here. Amen. That's why you have to change. Yes. Amen. Yes. Amen. That's why these Morenos uh, 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 have something to say now to you and your family. Oh, yeah. Amen. Yeah. That's why we are, uh, 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 well, we ain't going to try that. That white guy, well, Pastor Hurd and I have something. Oh, they, they call him Crazy Mike for a reason. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. We're going to trust him. Amen. He's in the church now. Oh, yeah. Amen. When he preaches the word that comes forth, he examines himself. Yeah. Amen. In ways that I don't examine myself yeah. or think to examine myself. Yeah. Amen. I was like, wow, Lord, I never thought about it that way. Wow, Lord, I never, I never considered that. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. He hates respect the person. Yes, yeah. Amen. And sometimes we show that. Amen. Sometimes we show that one to another. Amen. Amen. But read. My brethren. My brethren. Have not the faith of our Lord Yeshua Messiah, the Lord of glory, who respect the person. Uh-huh. 
For if there comes unto you a congregation a man with a gold ring and goodly apparel, and there comes in also a poor man in filthy clothes, clothing, and you have respect to him that wears splendid clothing, and say unto him, Sit you here in a good place, and say to the poor, Stand you there, or sit you here under my footstool. Are you not? Are you not then partial, uh, partial in yourselves? Are you not then partial in yourselves? And have become judges of evil and thoughts. And become judges of evil thoughts. Amen. Don't you know that it's possible, Amen, uh, to 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 uh, esteem more other people better, Amen, amen than the other. Amen. Don't you know that's easily possible? Amen. When black people come, I'm going to go talk to them. Uh -huh. Right? And all the Spanish people don't go talk to them. Oh, that's the black brother's job. You go do that. Uh -huh. Amen. Yeah. When a white person come, you know, Michael, step it up. <laughs> go, talk to, go talk to that uh, uh, guy over there. You know, we should be doing that. Don't get me wrong. We should be doing that. Amen. Yeah. But at the same time, you know, it's okay for the Spanish brother to go talk to the black one. Yeah. That's okay. Oh, yeah. Amen. You know, well, he's a black guy, so, you know, I'm going to let the black people handle that. <laughs> Amen. Yeah. There's a lot of Mexican people that come in here. Uh, Amen. Oh, yeah. We can't think that way. Because uh, not everybody's part Mexican in here. Amen. <laughs> <laughs> Amen. <laughs> Amen. We got to love one another the way Yahweh wants us to love one another. And it can't be respect the persons. That's easy to do. Amen. It's got to be a just balance. Read. Listen, my beloved brethren. Listen. Has not Yahweh chosen the poor of this world the rich, Read. rich in faith and heirs of the kingdom? You know, which you, has, you see poor people out there? You know, you see people at the at the grocery store and they, you know they're going to go ask you for a dollar. Amen. Yeah. Just that day you happen to have dollar bills. Uh -huh. Amen. Right. You happen to have dollars that day. Usually you can tell them, well, you know, I, I ain't got no cash. Uh -huh. And they'll, they'll respect that. Right. You know, but that day, well, you know, we can't lie. We say we can't lie. Amen. Amen. Yeah. Sometimes you want to tell them, I ain't got it right now, but you do. And you really can't afford uh -huh. to do it. You just want to do what you want to do with it. Right. Amen. Yeah. Don't you know we can't be respected persons of that? Yeah. Amen. That man has a soul. Uh -huh. That woman has a soul. Yeah. I thank y'all for Apostle Washington and the love that he has. Yeah. Amen. Amen. And, and for the, 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 the teachers that come forth from this place. Yeah. Amen. When we see people, we see, you know, we were the type of people that make fun of you in the world. Yeah. If you look funny, we told you about it. Amen. And we didn't. We had. We didn't care. Yeah. We didn't care how you felt about it. Amen. Yeah. If you were dumb, we'd say so. Oh yeah. Amen. We really did. Our family had no filter at all, yeah. and we took pleasure in doing that. Oh yeah. Not only that, because it made our, ourselves feel good. Right. Yeah. Amen. But at the same time, we got a, a chuckle from someone else. Yeah. You know, yeah. that was thinking the same thing. Amen. Amen. But don't you know that we can't be that way either? Amen. That's a spirit that we got to get rid of. Amen. Amen. And if Apostle Washington sees people, he sees people. He sees souls. Amen. See, a lot of us still see bodies. A lot of us still see flesh. Amen. We don't see souls. Amen. Amen. A lot of us just see flesh. Amen. That's why you can still uh, 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 argue with your husband. That's why you can still uh, be bitter with your wife. Because you still see flesh. Amen. That's why you can talk bad about the boss when he ain't looking. Amen. 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 That's why you can talk about how wrong the company is and how it's doing you. Because you still see body, you still see flesh. Amen. You know, uh, we were at the job the other day and they, have a, they had a show, they put on a show on my about 1,000 pound sisters. Amen. One was 600, the other one was four. Amen. And all kinds of laughter goes on. You know, there's some funny things that do happen on there. Amen. But I know that if Apostle were looking at this, Apostle would see two souls that need Yahshua, need saving. Two souls that need saving. Amen. Amen. Two souls that need saving. Amen. 
And, and we have to be that same way. Amen. We got to know that every soul is valuable. Amen. 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 We got to know that every soul is valuable. Hallelujah. That's why it's a blessing that, that Sister uh, Misty is, is spending time with her aunt. Amen. Amen. Right. You know, not all families are raised the same. Amen. A lot of families think that their family is better than everybody else's family. Yeah. Amen. Hallelujah. I know. I thought that way. Children, if you ain't a children, were you? What are you? <laughs> I'm seriously, that's our family is full of pride. Full of pride. Amen. If you, ain't, uh, you didn't really matter if you were anything outside of children. Amen. You ain't got the blood running through you? The blood? Like it was the number one blood. Like it, everybody was made out of our blood. Uh, our family still has that pride. Uh, <laughs> I, uh, I, uh, I remember Ace Sally, uh, we had uh, his uh, her grandson was on uh, the football team, and there's a picture. She said, that boy, a children's stock. You know what I'm saying? She was so proud. You know, and we are. We're proud of our family. I mean, the Washington's are proud people. Amen. If you ain't a Washington, what are you? <laughs> Amen. If you ain't a Picon, what are you? You ain't a Manriquez? Oh, what are you? <laughs> Amen. You ain't a riddle. You're not a Montoya. What are you? Yeah. Amen. And don't you know that we gotta fight that spirit? Amen. The Bible said that eat, we gotta esteem others better than ourselves. If you ain't a Cruz, what are you? Yeah. Amen. We had pride in our family. Yeah. Amen. But all families are different. All families are different. Amen. Amen. Uh, they weren't, we weren't raised the same. Amen. Our belief system is different. Amen. When I found out I had brothers that weren't from my mother, I was thrilled. Yeah. I got brothers. I got another sister. What? I ain't stuck with this same one. <laughs> <laughs> I love my sister, don't get me wrong. Yeah. Amen. But I love my brothers too. Yeah. Amen. When I found out about Corey, I was happy. Yeah. When I found out about Bobby, I was happy. Yeah. Patricia. Yeah. And I, I, it was sprung up on me. I knew about Corey because we lived there. Yeah. But my dad had a whole other family. I had no idea. It was just sprung up on me in the third grade. Yeah. <laughs> In the third grade, dad said, come on, son, you ride with me. What? Me? You need to take Michelle, right? The oldest, take Michelle with you. She already knew. Yeah, she already knew. But I think that night she's been like with Joy or something. <laughs> and he said, come on, son. And I went, and uh, well, first we had, we had, we had met uh, Brenda that morning. Hey man, she tried to give me some ice cream at Dairy Mart. <laughs> Dad introduced us. Me and, yeah. She already knew, but I was shocked. Right? But, and then when he took us, we rode the motorcycle over there and got out of the car, some strange house in some strange neighborhood I didn't know. We walked in there and there was that lady trying to give me some ice cream. Hey Amen. And three little chickens. Amen. There was a, a little boy with really good hair. <laughs> a little tall. I look like my, my little nephew is size a little bit. Amen. Oh, he has some real good hair. Curly locks. Amen. And then there was Patricia. Hair everywhere. Everywhere. They did not know how to take care of it. It was everywhere. To the point in high school and middle school, they called her Tina Turner. Because the hair was everywhere. Amen. And then there was Bobby. He was so tiny. He was like one or one and a half. He was barely moving, barely making, barely just a baby. Yeah. And my dad was like, yeah, this is your brother, Ernie. This is your sister, Patricia. And this is your brother, Bobby. I didn't get like, what are you talking about? <laughs> hey, man, I was, I was excited. I was thrilled. Yeah. Hey, man, to have that. But not all families was raised that way. Hey, man, some families... Uh, only want their family, amen? 
And, and I thank y'all for Sister Misty. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Because there was a time that we, we thought we had a great conversation. Yeah. Well, a long time ago when Mother Connie first came to, uh, you know, she said how her family was and how at first she was standoffish with Mother Connie. Yeah. Amen. Because of the, the, the sins of the father, the grandfather. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Standoffish. Yeah. Amen. And her, some of her family is still like that. Amen. They haven't le learned the love of God the way we've learned. Amen. 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 The way the Mr. Misty and her family has learned. Yes. Amen. That's why when I see Sister Misty pick her up, not because, uh, uh, well, finally, somebody going to go get her. No, not because of that. Not Amen. at all. Amen. Why do I got to go out the way? I live down the street. Amen. That's, a, that's, a, that's the devil. Amen. But to see them spending time together, breaking those chains. Amen. That the devil has put on that family. Amen. Amen. You, uh, what's done is done. You can't change the past. Amen. 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 What, they, they, what happened happened, and it did, you can't make it unhappen by saying, by ignoring the, what happened. Yes. Amen. Amen. But thank Yahweh that they're working on that spirit. Hallelujah. Amen. Yes. Amen. Mother Connie's a wonderful sister. Yes. Amen. She gave up everything Amen. to follow this God. Yes. Hallelujah. Amen. She gave up everything. Yes, Lord. Amen. Yes, and I thank Yahweh for that. Yes, I thank Yahweh for seeing y'all work on that. Yes, Amen. Amen. Yes. What, the, what are they doing? Uh, I was going to take her home one day. So Mr. Uh -uh. I'll take you home, mother. I was like, okay. <laughs> Amen. Not because I don't want to take her home. She lives down the street. Yes. But just to see that spirit. Amen. Doing the opposite of what the devil wants you to do. Yeah. Don't you know that's going to help her family? Amen. That's going to help her family accept her more? Yeah. Amen. And Because they're missing out on a blessing. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Missing yeah. out on a blessing. Yeah. Amen. Amen. The spirit that she has, amen, uh, is amazing. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Right. amen. And I thank Yahweh for that. Amen. amen. But read. Listen, my beloved brethren. Listen, my beloved brethren. Has not Yahweh chosen the poor of this world, rich in faith, and heirs of the kingdom which he has promised to, to them that love him? Which one of y'all got a lot of money? Let me know. I got bills. I need to talk to you. <laughs> Don't you know we're the poor of this world? Guess what? When my car breaks down, I got to have faith. Faith in a wing and a prayer. That's all I got. Faith in a prayer. Amen. Amen. My truck was broke down for like three months. Amen. Amen. I didn't have no money to fix it. All my, all my money went to the bills. Amen. Amen. Saving was almost impossible. Amen. 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 But Yahweh made a way. Yes, Amen. 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 When, 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 when your car breaks down, you're like, oh, Lord, what's that? <laughs> Amen. <laughs> you're thinking about your wallet. Uh -huh. You're thinking about... You're thinking about what, uh, how you're going to make it? Are you going to pay the bill? I hope that's something simple. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. That, uh, all of a sudden, you feel like praying. Yeah. Oh, Lord Yahweh. Oh, Lord. King of the universe. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All things in the world is yours. Yeah. You said a, a, cow, a, a cattle on a thousand hill are yours. If you was hungry, you wouldn't tell us. And now you quote scriptures, amen, <laughs> because you need him now. Amen. When we get sick, we can't just go fix it sometimes. Uh -huh. Amen. Right. We need him. Yeah. Amen. We can't run to the doctor every time we get sick. Amen. We can't afford to. Amen. 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 But didn't Yahweh choose the poor of this world, rich in faith? Heirs to the kingdom which he has promised. Aren't you that, heirs to, to the, the kingdom which he promised you? Amen. 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 We're the heirs to the kingdom. Amen. Amen. It's hard to get a rich man to come in here and do this. Yeah. It's hard to get a rich man to come in here and do this. Yeah. Amen. But you, don't you know you can't do it if you're rich in, fa in, 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 in spirit? Yeah, man. If you're rich in your own ways, uh, you won't make it. It's, hard for, it's, hard, it's going to be hard for you to make it. Amen. Amen. You can do everything you want to do. You want to do everything you want to do. The spirit says this and you say, eh. You find an excuse yeah, why you don't have to do it. Amen. Amen. You find an excuse why you don't have to do it. Amen. That means you got too much spirit. Amen. You got too much spirit. Amen. 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 Read. But you have despised the poor. 
Do not the rich of men oppress you and draw you before the judgment seat? Amen. Don't they do that? Yeah. Amen. 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 They despise the poor. Uh -huh. Amen. Right now, Mother Connie, for her family, she's poor. Amen. Amen. In her family's eyes. Amen. Amen. And her and the rich of her family despise her. Amen. 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 The ones in, in, here in Lubbock, except for the few that are in this church. Amen. Amen. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. Don't you know that? Amen. Your family's uh, too rich if they can't accept her. Amen. Amen. And if you do her, by, if you do her good, they'll run you in the mud. Hallelujah. They ask you, why are you doing that? Yeah. Why are you spending time with them? Amen. Why are you spending time with him? Why are you doing extra with them? Don't you know who they are? Yeah. Amen. They too rich. Amen. Amen. They'll bring you before the court. They'll bring you to judgment. Amen. And question what, what you're doing. Amen. But read. Do they not blaspheme that worthy name by which you are called? Don't they talk bad about you? Amen. That worthy name, here you are. You sacrificed everything, changed your life. The only reason they're using Yahweh and doing all those things because of you. And won't they despise, won't they talk down on your name? Amen. Read. If you fulfill the royal law according to the scripture. The what law? The, the royal this law. This is a royal law. Amen. It's not just a law, it's a royal law. Amen. In the scripture, that means that it still applies. Amen. This law still applies. It's a royal law. Amen. Set from the king. Hallelujah. What's it saying? If, if you fulfill the royal law according to the scripture, you shall love your neighbor as yourself. What? You do well. Love your neighbor as yourself. Hallelujah. Love, the royal law is what? You love you shall love your neighbor as yourself. You gotta love your neighbor like yourself. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Yeah. Some people don't want to hear this. Amen. Some people don't want to hear that. Amen. 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 Because it's gonna cause suffering. Hallelujah. It's gonna cause you to get inconvenient. Amen. Amen. Yeah. I think Yahweh for my wife. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Hallelujah. You know, I think Yahweh so that every time uh my sister would leave or come back. We, we took her in. Yes. Amen. Yes. Amen. Every time her kids would come and want to serve the Lord, we took them in. Amen. Yes. Amen. Yes. And, and it bothered my wife uh, sometimes for a little while. At times. Uh, it does get hard. Amen. 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 My wife asked me one day, why do we always got to bring in your family? I told her, honey, if your family was coming in, we'd bring them in too. Amen. I said, if it was your sister that wanted to serve the Lord, Amen. and she had no way to do it, and she wanted to come, we'd have let her move in. Hallelujah. Your uncle, your aunt, whoever Amen. was trying to serve the Lord, we'd bring them on in. Amen. It just so happened it's my family that's doing that right now. Amen. 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 I told my wife, I said, I told her before my mom met Elder, of course, I told her, I said, my, if my mom ever gets sick and old and can't take care of herself, we, she's moving in. Amen. My wife was like, hey. <laughs> Do her teeth, hey, man. And, and, and I said, but your mom, we're going to put her in a nursing home. I didn't say that. I didn't say that. My mama, when she gets old and can't take care of herself, we're going to bring her in, I told her. I didn't tell her, and your mama gets sick, we're going to go ahead and put her in a nursing home because, you know, they know what they're doing and things like that. I, I didn't tell her that. I said, if your mama gets sick, and your mama get too old and she can't take care of herself. I said, your mama can move in too. Amen. Did I say that? Amen. Yes. Because I, it can't be no respect to persons. Why is my family more important? Amen. And her, her family don't get no, no chance. Why don't her family get a chance? Amen. If any one of them decided to serve the Lord, we'll be there. Yes. Amen. Yes. Amen. Any one of them. Amen. That's the royal law. It said, love your neighbor. As yourself. You Read. do well. You'll do well if you do that. Amen. My dad would take in strangers yes. to live with him. Yes. One stole his TV. Yes. Pawned it. <laughs> and then sold him back the tickets. <laughs> and then my dad let him move in again. Yes. Again. Yes. Amen. Apostles, they let a, a stranger come into the house yeah. with their children there. Yeah. He was in the streets. He wasn't even nobody they knew. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Rachel was still there. Yeah. Vulnerable. 
uh, 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 Harvey was uh, small. They couldn't defend nothing. They were tiny. I mean, they weren't tiny. They were in middle school and all that, but still, they're just children. Amen. Amen. And they let this man, the apostle picked this man up, brought him to the house, let him spend the night with the candy and say, where are he sleeping at? Where is he going? Don't you know I got Rachel up in there? Don't you know I got Harvey and Beret? She didn't say that. She followed the spirit. She followed her husband and what he wanted. She knows that he's a man of God and she knows where we at. Yahweh is our protector. Amen. Yahweh is our protector. He's our protector. Amen. Amen. And so he moved in and they were they were laying in there and they all of a sudden they were bling a ling a ling ling ling. He's in the cabinet. Bling ling 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 ling. He's in the drawers. Amen. Of course you want to get up. Of course you want to say something. What are you doing? Get out. That's the flesh. That's the flesh. Amen. But what did they do? They said, they said, uh, Pastor, leave, leave him alone. He's, he's in need. He's in need. And they steal from him. They're in need. He's a homeless man. Father said, when he picked up the man's backpack, it was heavier. Because, yeah, he picked it up. He picked it up and brought it in the first time. The second time, it was, way, it was weighty. Very heavy. He saw his stuff in there and then helped him zip it up. Because charity covers the multitude of sins. <laughs> That's the love of God. Amen. That's Amen. the love of God. Amen. It's easy to say that you have it until it's time to prove it. Until it's time to prove it. Amen. When they say, who's going to go see Mother Connie? She raised our hand. We went and gone. She wasn't our family. Not yet. She wasn't baptized. <laughs> Amen. Amen. But if any soul needs help. Yes, we should be the first ones. Amen. Especially if we family. Yes. Yes. Amen. Read. Hallelujah. Amen. But if you have respect to persons, uh -huh. you commit sin. You commit what? Sin. sin. You commit what? Sin. sin. And the wages of sin is what? Yes. Death. Don't you know that's why we got to clean ourselves up? Amen. We have to clean ourselves up, saints. We got to have no spot, right. no wrinkle, yeah. no blemish. Yeah. We can't have nothing in our, when we face God. Yeah. But see, we're men, so we weigh sins differently. Yeah. We're the one that put weight on sin. Yeah. Oh, he committed adultery, he weighed on him. Oh, she committed adultery, she weighed on him. Yeah. But if you respect the person, you weigh down there with them. Yeah. In the eyes of Yahweh, yeah. you weigh down there with them. Amen. If you lie, you down there too. I only lied once today. Amen. You right there with the person that killed somebody. Because you're all going to be cast into the lake of fire if you don't repent. And turn. Repent don't mean just be feel sorry for it and, and say, well, okay, that well, I just, you know, I feel bad that I did that. No, you got to you gotta put fruit and actions to that. Amen. Faith without works is dead. Easy to say. Faith without works is dead. Right? If you if to say, you know, what the scripture says, it says, you see a man in need, and you say, you hungry? You know, he's, you, you have the thing to give him if he's hungry and he's thirsty, and you don't give it. You say, well, go and Yahweh be with you. He'll give you everything you need. Hallelujah. Amen? Yeah. You didn't help him at all. Yeah. You didn't help him. Right. But read. But if you have respect to persons, uh -huh. you commit sin. You commit sin. And are convicted of the law of the, as transgressors. A and you're convicted of the law as transgressors. Uh-huh. For whoever shall keep the whole law and yet offends in one point, he is guilty of it all. He is guilty of it all. Amen. So in, the eyes, in that day, you, uh, you might as well did everything devilish you wanted to do. Amen. Amen. If I get caught drunk on that day, right. I might as well have never came to the church. This is going to be the same end. Yeah. Amen. If you get caught outside the will of God on that day, it's like you might have never came to the church. Amen. Because your end is going to be, it's still going to be the same. You're going to die in your sins. That's why I love this place. Amen. Yahweh doesn't, he doesn't hold his peace for us. Amen. He doesn't hold his peace for us. He knows what it takes to get there. Amen. And, and things that are written in the scriptures are written for our learning. Amen. That we, through patience, and, be, and this, this scripture should comfort you. 
Amen. Knowing, okay, Lord, we sing, search me, Lord, search me, Lord. If you find anything that shouldn't be, take it out. And you wave your hand and bob your head and all that to it. And <laughs> tears come down and you're spinning around and all that. Uh, Amen. But when he points something out, all of a sudden you, your stomach hurts. All of a sudden, the, the, the baby cries out. Amen. Kids get sick. Get All of a sudden, you got to run out of here. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. 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 It's like that wounded finger. Amen. You want to protect it. Uh -huh. Amen. But the doctor is broken. That finger is broken. Yeah. You don't want the doctor to fix it. You, you don't want him to touch it. But he's got to grab it and pull it and put it together. He's going to have to, he's gonna, he's gonna have to grab it and, and, and work it out and yeah. stretch it out and put it on a stick. you got it curled up this way. Yeah. He's going to have to fix that. It's going to hurt. Amen. Amen. That's why we got to fight that spirit of run. Amen. we got to fight that running spirit. Because we're, we're wounded right there. We don't want Yahweh to fix that. Amen. But the truth is, we, gotta, we should sit there and take that medicine. Amen. Amen. I don't think there's nobody been beat on this church more than me. <laughs> nobody. Kuta Kente Childers. <laughs> Toby, I've been beat. Called by my name. All those things. But where can I go? Amen. Sometimes it takes that heart beating. Amen. To straighten a hard-headed person up like me. Amen. Amen. There was a possible preacher by Robert Lee. Uh, they whoop him every day. Every day. He just wouldn't learn. You wonder where that started? That started with me. In the seventh grade, I got, I got, I got, I got licks every day. In the seventh grade, from day one to the last day, I got from the principal or from the coaches. I got, I got a paddling every day. Every day, I'm, not, I'm making that up. Every day, I knew I was gonna get a paddling that day. I just wonder who it was coming from. Because I was always doing stuff or not doing what I'm supposed to do. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Amen? It's time to dress off a PE. I ain't doing it. <laughs> I can run just as good in these pants as I can in the little baby shorts you want me to have. <laughs> them baby shorts. Yeah, I be wearing them baby shorts that I can run around with. <laughs> them little baby shorts. I'm going to be wearing that. I'm going to wear my jeans. I can, I, can, I can run and jump and do all that stuff. These, these jeans ain't hanging, holding me down. I ain't finna put that on. I ain't finna go take time and change and do all that. We, let's, just, let's run in these clothes. So every day, I got licks from that. I go in there and, and the coaches, there's three coaches. There's Coach De La Serta, Coach James, and Coach McNeil, and there's another coach, Coach Williams. And all of them was built like a truck. And they say, child's play. I say, yeah, they say, which one you want from today? I say, y'all choose. It don't matter. It's the same end. <laughs> and they tried to bat me to the moon. I'm telling you, they, they had arms like my legs. They were huge. And they hit me, pow. And the other guys that got licks, they was all, Ooh. I was just like, Whoa. Mm. see y'all tomorrow. Amen. Amen. So it, it didn't start with Robert Lee. It started with me. Amen. 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 In my ways, in my heart headedness and, yeah. and things like that. Yeah. But I thank Yahweh for the mercy that he has for people like me. Amen. For people like my children. Amen. Yeah. Some of us got to learn the hard way. Amen. Amen. But Yahweh had mercy on people like yeah. us. Yeah. I thank Yahweh that he had mercy on Apostle Washington. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. If he didn't have mercy on Apostle, we wouldn't be here. Amen. Our family wouldn't be here. We'd have given up a long time ago Amen. or never even found the place. Right. Yeah. Amen. We'd have been just like every other soul out there. Yeah. That with their own mind of what Yahweh is, yeah. with their own mind of what God's supposed to be. Amen. Right. Amen. Yeah. But read. For he, for he that said, do not commit adultery, said also, do not kill. That's right. Now, if you commit no adultery, yet if you kill, you have become a transgressor of the law. You become a transgressor of the law. Read. Amen. So speak you, and do so, 
as the, <laughs> as they that shall be judged by the law of liberty. Uh huh. For he shall have judgment without mercy, that ha that has shown no mercy. Don't and you mercy know if you're merciless, judgment. If you don't have no mercy, you're gonna be judged with no mercy on that day. You'll be judged with no mercy on that day if you don't have mercy. Amen. Amen. If you don't if you don't have love, you're gonna be judged with no love. If you're not gracious towards people, if you're not patient, yeah. Yahweh's not going to be patient with you. Amen. I mean, if you don't forgive in that day, there'll be no forgiveness for you. Amen. Because he taught us, do unto others. Yeah. Is that do unto others yeah. as you would have them do unto you. Amen. How would you want to be done if you was in that situation? Amen. Would you not want mercy? Amen. Yeah. When you mess up, Amen. don't you go before the Lord and ask for mercy? Amen. But if you're merciless, you're going to get no mercy. Amen. Amen. Right. Read. For he, for he shall have judgment without mercy, that has shown no mercy, and mercy rejoices against judgment. And mercy rejoices against judgment. So if you have mercy on that day of judgment, you won't have nothing, he won't have nothing evil to say about you. Amen. You'll receive your mercy as well. Yes, mercy rejoice against judgment. Read. What does it profit, my brethren? Though a man says he has faith and not has works, can faith save him? Can faith save him? Yeah. Read. If a brother or sister is naked and destitute of daily food, and one of you says unto them, Depart in peace. Be you warned and be filled, notwithstanding you give them not those things which are need needful to the body. What does it profit? What does it profit them? Amen. Read. Even so faith, if it has not works, is dead. What? Being alone. If even so if faith has not, has works, not works, is dead. Is dead, being alone. Be be just believing is not enough to save you. Amen. Amen. There are people out there that say, I believe in God. I Amen. believe in the word. I believe in the scriptures. Hallelujah. I believe. Yeah. But if they love your enemy, well, I ain't going to do that. I believe it, though. But I ain't going to do it. They say, bless the curse not. Well, I believe that. But I'm not going to do it. Amen. Love your enemies. I mean, I believe it's in there. He said it. I believe it. But, uh, but, but just believing is not enough. It's like that song. You say it's not enemies. enough. Faith without works is what? Dead. Being alone by itself is nothing. Read. Yes. Yes, a man may say, you have faith and I have works. Show me your, show me. your faith with, without your works. Show me. And I will show you my faith by works. Show me. Amen. Show me. Amen. You got this is the show me. You got to show me. Apart, <laughs> Yahweh wants us to show him. Amen. 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 Yeah. We're going to be judged by our deeds. Amen. What we chose to do in this life. That's what we're going to be judged on. Whether they were good or whether they were evil. Amen. The things that you did. That's what you're going to be judged on. Your deeds. Amen. Amen. You're just, just believing is not enough. Well, I believe you should be uh, uh, baptized in the name of Yahshua. Well, you going to do it? Well, no. But I believe it. Well, what, what did it profit you? What did it profit you? What did it profit you? You believe it? That what happened when they uh, ministered here. Uh -huh. Amen. He's teaching everybody, you all should be baptized in the name of Yahshua yeah. Messiah. Uh -huh. If I said, are you baptized? Well, no, I'm not. <laughs> are you going to? Well, Yahshua, well, Yahweh knew what I, Yahshua knew what I need, what I meant when I baptized in the name of Jesus. Oh, you know what we meant too? Yeah. <laughs> Why well, we all got to do it. We all, he understood that when we got baptized, Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost. You want to go all the way back? He understood that we was trying to do the right thing. If you want to just go all the way back, don't just stop at Jesus. Let's go all the way back then. He understood when I just got sprinkled instead of dipped. He understood that I was trying to do the right thing. Amen. He knew what I meant. Amen. Amen. That faith without that work is dead for him. Yeah. Teaching everybody and that day when he stands before the Lord, the Lord going to say, how can you want to baptize in my name? He's going to say, you know what I meant? They ain't going to save him. The truth is, you just don't want to do it. You don't want to inconvenience yourself. Is it now it's too inconvenient to obey the will of God. 
It's too inconvenient. That's better than what you're saying. Amen. You man, that's why I said, judge not. Yeah. The same judgment you dish out is going to come back to you. Yeah. Same judgment. Yeah. And when it fell back on him, he was found wanting. Yeah. Right. Amen. Amen. Read. You believe that there is one God. You do well. You do well. Yeah. The devils also believe and tremble. Yeah. Read. But you, but you will know, O oh vain man, that faith without works is dead. What do he call you? O oh vain man. He called us a vain man. Amen. Faith without works is dead. Yeah. You know, it comes time for me not to be bitter with my wife. Amen. Amen. Uh, she getting on my last nerve. Amen. Amen. With some of the choices that she made or something that she said to me. Yeah. Right? Now I want to have an attitude. Yeah. Separate myself. Yeah. And Grant Garen, you scripture too. Amen. Yeah. Bible said better to dwell in the corner of the rooftop. In the house with a brawling woman. I'm just doing what the scripture saying, getting away from her. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Use that scripture wrongly. Uh -huh. Amen. Yeah. And when she says something, you snap. Yeah. Ooh, look at this. Look at what? Yeah. Snap. Yeah. Uh huh. Amen. We say, reverence your husband. Uh huh. She said she wanted to do for my uncle Paul. You know, I was, I was talking to a. Uh, um, Apostle Moses, uh, before he left, and he was saying how Sister Rebecca was very like, like Elder Arthur was dying, and his mom, her mom, was all over Elder Arthur about everything all the time, to the point that he was like, I have no rest. I am basically living in Hades. His life was terrible, he was saying. He was like, she controls me. She, every, I can't do anything. Everything is, it's terrible for me. I'd rather die, is what he was saying. Uh, because of the way that she controlled him. Yeah. What she told Apostle Moses. And Sister Rebecca had so much compassion for him. Getting on her mom, like, won't you give him some peace? And why don't you do this and do that? And Apostle Moses looked at her and said, what about me? You do me the same way. He told her, you do me just like that. Why, he get compassion, but I don't. I'm your husband. I'm the one, the way your mom is doing him is the way you are doing me. But she didn't see that. She didn't see that part. Amen. Amen. Why? You're too close. Yeah. We get too close. Amen. That's why I thank y'all for this place. Teach not to get too close. Amen. 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 Mother Watson knows her, her role as, as an apostle, as a, her, his role as a husband, and his role as a bishop. Amen. At the time, she got to separate the two. Except there's times you gotta separate the two. Okay, he's a bishop right now. He's not my husband. He's Apostle Washington. Amen. And sometimes he, uh, you, we gotta separate ourselves. Okay, that's not my friend, Mother Karen. That's Mother Washington right now. Sometimes it's like, oh, that's my friend, Mother Karen. She loves me. She's my friend until she rebuke you. Amen. Then you gotta realize that that's not your friend, Mother Karen, that's talking. That's that woman supervisor. Supervising. Amen. The Spirit Mom. called us all out the other day. Oh, yeah. Had us all watching ourselves and looking at you. are a supervisor? Amen. What have you been supervising? Yeah. Nothing? Yeah. You ain't been doing your job? You ain't at your post? You a watchman and ain't been on your post? Yeah. The Spirit, did he, he worked all the head of the whole church. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Made me straighten up. Made me, I went on a fast the next day. Yeah. I said, help me in my unbelief and strength and my weaknesses. Let me correct those things that I've uh, not been uh, on my post on. Amen. Amen. Got me on the right track. Amen. You know, that soul going to be required at your hand. You're a bishop. That soul going to be required at your hand. You're a supervisor. You ain't doing what you're supposed to do. Your soul, that soul will be required at your hand. Their blood is required at your hand. Amen. I don't want to go. I got enough blood on my hands for my own sin. Yes, I don't need theirs too. Yes, so I'm going to cry aloud. Yes, I'm going to spare not. Yes, Amen. Amen. But see, I, I, I'm going to be respected first too. I don't want to tell my family. You know, I can't be that way. Nope. Right. Whosoever loves father and mother more than me, yeah. brother, sister, wife, not husband, not children, your own self. Amen. And most of us love our own self above everything. Amen. Amen. Read. Amen. Was not Abraham our father justified by works? Yes. 
when he had offered Isaac his son upon the altar? Yes. See you, now, see you how faith works with, with his works. Uh -huh. And by works was faith made perfect. That's right. And the scripture was fulfilled, which says, Abraham believed God Yahweh, <coughs> and it was imputant unto him for righteousness. Amen. Let's go to James real quick before they come out. James 4, Hallelujah. and we'll start the sixth verse. <coughs> Amen. James 4 and 6, read. But he gives more grace. What? But he gives more grace. But Yahweh gives us more grace, saints. Amen. He gives us a chance to fix those things that are broken in us. Amen. Thank Yahweh for the grace that he gives us. Amen. He gives more grace. Amen. Read. He gives, he, but he gives more grace. Therefore, he says, God, Yahweh resists the proud, but he gives grace to the humble. So if you're proud, you'll just know that he's going to resist you. Yeah. When I was prideful, he resisted me. Yeah. But he gives grace to the humble. Read. Yeah. Submit yourselves, therefore, to Yahweh. No, nah, keep fighting it. Resi submit yourself, therefore, to Yahweh. Now I have some buts about it. Submit yourself, therefore, to Yahweh. You submit ourselves to Yahweh. Uh-huh. Resist the devil. Resist him. And he will flee from and you. And he leave. Yes. You got to fight him, though. If you're just giving in to everything, yeah. he ain't going nowhere. Yeah. You know, sometimes on your evil days, he bring a thought and you just dwell on it. Yeah. And you entertain it. Yeah. Yeah. And then you fall. Yeah. Because you didn't resist. Yeah. But on those fast days, the days you're doing good, concentration days, you resist everything he throws at you. He can't stick around. Yeah. Read. Draw near to Yahweh. Draw and, near to Yahweh. And he will draw near to you. And he'll draw near to you. Cleanse your hands, you sinners. What? Clean your hands, you sinners. Clean your hands, you sinners. And purify your hearts, you double-minded. And we got to purify our hearts if we're double-minded. It's easy to be double-minded. Yes. To halt between two spirits. Yes. Amen. Yes. To say, well, Yahweh says this, but I feel... Yahweh says this, but I feel. Amen. I feel. Amen. Amen. We can't lean on our feelings. They deceive us. Yahweh, like Apostle Hurley was preaching, he made feelings. Amen. But we can't lean on those things. Because if we were waiting for a feeling to, serve, uh, feeling to come to serve God, we would have never got that feeling. You're dying in your sins. Amen. Amen. If you felt like loving your enemy, that will never happen. When you look at them, there's still something about it that, that, that you got to fight. You see them, you like, thank you, Lord. You got to love, because you know you have to love them if you want to be saved. There's a part of your flesh that doesn't like it. It resists. Amen. But I think Yahweh for this place. I think Yahweh for this word. Amen. I think Yahweh for the, for the mercy that he has on us, for the teachings that come from this place. Read. Be afflicted. What? Be afflicted. That and means put your, make yourself do things you don't want to do. Amen. Be afflicted. It's not like they used to say back in the day when they beat themselves. They have those monks that used to beat themselves with their own whips and all that, afflicting themselves that way. Hallelujah. Amen. They're not talking about physically beat yourself up, Amen. you know, go and, and, and do a penance and sit in the corner and whoop yourself in the back. Hallelujah. And uh, That's not what it's talking about, about afflict yourself. Amen. It's saying do the will of God even though you don't want to do it. Amen. That's what afflicting yourself is. Amen. Amen. Being obedient to the word when your flesh doesn't want to do it. Yes. Amen. Amen. But I thank Yahweh for the word that came forth. I, pr I pray that it find and that it help you. Amen. Thanking Yahweh for the word that's coming forth in Mexico. Amen. That we have uh, uh, two services here. Amen. At the same time. Kind of like a, like, a, like a big church, you know. So big you had to have two services. But we have people that need the word of Yahweh. Amen. We have people that, uh, in Mexico that need to hear this word. Amen. Amen. Thank Yahweh for the love of Apostle Washington. Amen. 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 The love that he teaches us to show. Amen. 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 That's why we got to give our testimony after, after church. <laughs> We're supposed to give our testimony after church. Some of us. I mean, I'm not sure we're still doing that, but we're supposed to give our testimony to the saints of Mexico. Yeah. Amen. So that they can hear our testimony. They can get encouraged by us. Because, let them know that we love them as well. Hallelujah. Amen. The love that apostle teaches us to love them from. And his love comes from Yahweh. But truly, we have our apostle in the midst. Let all saints rise and receive him by saying, praise Yahweh. Praise Yahweh.
Amen. Amen. Please always stand. Everyone can be seated. Um, Sister Justine, where's she at? In the back. Um, hallelujah. Amen. Y'all we good? All the time. Uh, y'all probably wonder what, I, what I'm about to say, huh? They got that look on y'all face. Um, she's in the back. Okay, okay, okay. It's good to be here this morning. Yes, um, thanking him, the most high for blessing us to see the day that wasn't promising to us. Yes. Hallelujah. And Hallelujah. we thank him this morning. Trust that he accept our songs and testimony. Yes, Lord. Miss, uh, Sister um, um, uh, uh, Riddles, if you would, can you go ahead and take those in the back, call them one by one, the Spanish saints that's going to give a testimony, and go ahead and record them, the testimony. You say what again? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's do that. And uh, just she'll come and get you one at a time. <coughs> uh, you don't. And if some of our English-speaking saints want to give a testimony, you can do that too. Um, we'll have our guest Madeline to to uh, interpret uh, uh, the um, testimonies. Okay. All right. So we we got a job on our hand, don't we? Yes, we do. Yes, Lord. And, Yahweh entrusted us with this gospel, with this message, and it's up to us to get it out yes, uh, to the people. Um, and it takes a labor. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. You have to labor to, amen, to do this here. Amen. That's um, right. It's like a job. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's like a real job. Mm -hmm. you, you just don't get no real money. That's all. <laughs> not this life. <laughs> not, 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 not this labor. You get, you're gonna get eternal life, but then, nah, hey man, you're not, you're not, you're not gonna give me no money out of church. So. <laughs> Hallelujah. Yes. I'm not saying that you're not in need of money, but I, I, ain't, I just ain't got it to help nobody right That's now. That's right. Hey yeah. man. Yeah. But it's a blessing to be here. I want to thank y'all with my wife. He blessed me with. She's a, a very lovely sister, and yes. I know that she really loved this ministry, and she loved you all. And yes, Lord, um, brother and sister, it, it, it's going to take a made up mind. And mm -hmm. the devil is real, and of course, he wants to root us all up. And yes, Lord. If you're not careful, you take us. Yes, you will. You can't have that, right? No, Lord. Um, we should not have this understanding why we are here. Mm -hmm. You know. Uh, Bible talks about this lame man that sat at the gate of beautiful and he sat there every day expecting alms from the people. Mm -hmm. the, uh, Peter and, uh, and John, they come by and they saw him there and the Bible said he was expecting to receive something of them. Yes. And, he, and Peter looked and said, look, well, silver and gold we don't have. We don't have. Don't have. And one thing about the church is we not just, we struggle. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Amen. Yes. We sometimes we we live from one check to another check. Amen. Sometimes we have to be there to help one another out. Mm -hmm. We're not we're not rich. Amen. Every now and then, Lord blesses I have some for spending money. Yes. Every now and then. Uh, hallelujah. That's right. And we get excited about that and be, mm -hmm. you know, go do things that we unable to do, you know, during the year. Mm -hmm. Um. But one thing we do have yes. is far more better than silver and gold. Amen. Hallelujah. Mm -hmm. Amen. And more precious than silver and gold. Amen. That's the truth. That's right. You know, despite what this building looked like outside and in, it's not the most uh, glorious church by you know, you know, just you know, just seeing with the eyes mm -hmm. in the city of Lubbock. Amen. I'm pretty sure we way down at the bottom. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh yeah. Maybe not the worst one, but we way down at the bottom. Amen. No beauty they should Hallelujah. <laughs> but one thing we do have when one we come we in do. this place. We do have. We have the truth. Amen. 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 We have the very thing that can give a man life. And I was reminded the church in Mexico, the words of the Lord, the Lord said, Amen. Everyone that asketh receive it. Mm -hmm. And everyone knock at the door is open. Amen. And everyone that will seek will find. Mm -hmm. I know all of this to be true. Yes. I've been serving the Lord since I was 20 years old. Amen. And he have always been there. Always. I was hearing one testimony about a 
thinking maybe it was our diesel, or maybe it was Miss. I'm not for sure about. <coughs> they seen the, the power of God. Amen. Uh, in their own husband. <coughs> yes. And we should never ever close our eyes on Amen. Jesus and forget. Yes. What the Most High have done for us. Hallelujah. Yes. No one can tell me that the church is not the best thing for them. Amen. No it wouldn't be truthful. It wouldn't be That's truthful. Right. Even the backsliders, they say that wouldn't be truthful. No, it wouldn't. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes. You tell other folk who are ignorant about mm -hmm. this way. But I've tried the law for myself. Oh, yeah. Yes. I, I'm just like the apostle said, he's a lively stone. Amen. Disallowed indeed a man. Indeed. Don't some men just don't want him in their life. Amen. Indeed. They want him to do everything for him, but they don't want him in their life. Right. right. Hallelujah. Yes. But this thing is chosen. We have chosen mm -hmm. him yeah. above everything. Oh, yeah. Hallelujah. Yes. Hallelujah. I Hallelujah. said we have chosen him above everything. Amen. He's alive and he's precious. Yes, he is. Yes. To me, Yeshua is precious. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes. Amen. Hallelujah. Paul began to write to the Romans in the sixth chapter. Hallelujah. Yes. And these are his words to the believers. Amen. Romans yeah. 6 and 1. Uh -huh. It is written. Uh -huh. What shall we say then? Amen. Man. We know Yahweh been good to us. Amen. Yeah. Yeah. You know. I say we know he's been good to us. Oh, yeah. Hallelujah. Amen. What do you got to say about the church? What do you got to say about him? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. you allow your conditions to not talk right. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Yes. What shall we say? Shall we continue in hey, sin? Hallelujah. Shall we continue in sin? Didn't leave nobody. I said we. You know why I said we? You know why I said we? Because we are a body. Amen. Amen. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yes. We are a body. You know, you have to start caring about the body. That's yes. Right. Amen. You don't right. care about the body, amen, you don't care how you walk. Yeah. That's right. So it doesn't matter to you what people outside the church will say about us. Amen. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. yeah. I thought y'all don't believe like that. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. mm -hmm. I thought y'all don't go to places like that. Right. I thought y'all don't do that. Yes. Uh -huh. Hallelujah. Amen. We want to walk in a way that the believers, the unbelievers out there, those that don't know this way, Mm -hmm. Amen. We yes. come this way because of our faith in God. Amen. Because of your testimony. Yes. What Yahweh have done mm -hmm. in your life. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. We, amen. We have something to be, amen, to brag about. Hallelujah. Yes, yeah. we do. This is the only place I know can take a wino and clean them up. Yes. That's it. Only this place. Amen. The only place I ever known that can take someone's heavy on drugs. Heavy. Hallelujah. And yes. Amen. To redeem them from that kind of lifestyle. Heavy oh, on yeah. drugs. I know. That's right. Yes. Being a whore in the world. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. The majority does. That's what we were. What we were. Fornicators. Yes. Mm. Hallelujah. Yeah. Yes. I was no prostitute. Well, at least they got paid for it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you were close. Yeah. Amen. <laughs> You're a prostitute. Yeah, uh -huh. you was. It's just Four that the prostitute get, get paid for it. Amen. They get paid to sleep around. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. You did it for free. You did it free. <laughs> <laughs> uh, hallelujah. But uh -huh. well, we heard the word here. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. How you man? Amen. No, we needed help. Yes. It's hard to change our ways and yes, chose to believe. Mm-hmm. Repent and got baptized. Mm -hmm. yes, down Lord. in water. Amen. Amen. I'm something brand new, right. new creature. Yes. See, now I'm living. Amen. I remember when I stopped dancing, people would come by my house just to see they didn't believe that Junebug cut his hair and he stopped dancing. Uh -huh. They didn't believe it. They had to come by the house, see what they say. Knock on the door, just look at me and turn and walk off. Uh -huh. Yeah. Well, why you think Prophet is, uh, Apostle Stanley was in the church? He didn't believe me. Uh-uh. Yeah. Amen. He, yeah, he, they, they said, let me, what, 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 let me go check on him. <laughs> and it's all, my hair was cut off. All of them. Hey, Amen. I opened mm -hmm. the book and witnessed to him, and he went on and clipped his off. Uh-huh. <laughs> Hallelujah. That's right. Are you listening to me, brother? Yes, sister? Lord. That's how wonderful this thing is to you that have understanding. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. And he's been striving ever since, and y'all have touched and healed his house. Ever since. Got a wife that walked just like Mother Washington. Have a wife that loved this ministry. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Come on, read. What shall we now, say then? Now, we know since we have all of this, this blessing that God has bestowed upon us. Mm -hmm. How are you talking? Amen. What shall we say then? Shall we continue in shall sin? Shall we keep on blaming folks while we what we are? That grace may abound. 
You think, amen, God's grace going to allow you to continue in that? God forbid. It may be the last time you hear this truth. Amen. It might be the last time. Be the last time you ever go to church. That's Might've right. The Bible said, God forbid. God forbid. Mm-hmm. How shall we? How shall we? We ain't talking about folks outside the church. No, Lord. We're talking about you that's in the church. That are dead to How's, sin. We're supposed to be dead to sin. Live any longer you mean, therein. You mean you ain't got past your anger yet? Amen. You mean you haven't controlled your eyes yet? Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Hallelujah. Yes. You're supposed to be dead to sin. Amen. We shouldn't be living in sin no yes. longer. No longer. That's right. Mm-hmm. Oh, y'all listening to me. Amen. Shouldn't be living in sin no longer. That's right. Still talking about people. Hallelujah. Amen. Uh-huh. You black still talking about white people. Uh-huh. Like they still did you wrong. Yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Amen. Won't forgive. Amen. Don't know how to forgive. Right. Amen. Every time you see Junior, you bring up what he did to you, and it was like 33 years ago. Uh-huh. And you still bring it up like it was still last right. night. Uh-huh. The way you talk, people swear right. that it happened last night. I remember like it was yesterday. Yeah. That's right. When you going to let all that stuff go? Right. Yeah. Yeah. Let the sun set you free. Amen. Whom the sun set. That's why I'm going to share that long testimony. See, when you, when you always tell you, always doing something uh-huh. in your life. Yeah. You may want her to shut up and be still. Mm. Be quiet, but she got to testify. Like fire set up in a bone. Amen. She's, work, she's, she's working on herself. Yeah. Hallelujah. And, the, oh, yeah. and, that, and that was a testimony of the show. Yeah. Her son called. That was y'all way working. Amen. Work. You know how long she be? Amen. See, well, some yeah. of y'all don't just don't care folks don't talk to you. Yeah. <laughs> it don't matter they call you up. Right. But when you take on the right spirit, you start caring like you never cared before. Amen. That's a son. Yeah, the Cause son. her labor. Her first you never know. Her firstborn may be he in here with his wife. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yeah. So yeah, I, I make sure I get me a bus ticket and go on down and we can be part of that wedding. Yeah. That, that's, that's your family. Amen. Yeah. Yes. That'd be nice. Amen. Yeah. Junior need Yeshua too. Yes, he does. Amen. Hallelujah. And then Junior on your side and Junior start getting back with Daddy. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Daddy, you lied. You didn't uh, tell me that part. Yeah. Man. Uh-huh. You need to come on and get back with mama. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. <laughs> then working can, it out. Then I come on back to church and say, we're brothers. Yeah. <laughs> oh, how we love one another. Oh, how we love one another. Uh-huh. We <laughs> put our man. trust in each other. We put our trust in one another, start trusting one another again. <laughs> yeah. You know, without the, the law, we can't trust nobody. I can't no, trust no. you without the law. I cannot oh, no. trust you. You thug. By no means. Yeah. yeah. Thug. My oldest mother Mary, she still can steal. Yeah. Uh, both hands, yeah. finger works. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Yeah, so that's right. Most sometimes people think when we get old, hey, man, it's just, it's just easy. That was my Madeline testifying. Tomorrow when she get old, then she'll wear dresses. <laughs> <laughs> she thought. Yeah, what she said. Uh, she she thought. thought. Amen. Amen. But she came, she heard the words of Yahweh. Amen. Hallelujah. That's right. She said she got rid of her makeup immediately. Mm-hmm. Yeah. When you get your mind right, you all that stuff wrong in your life, you get rid of it immediately. It don't take, it don't, hey amen, don't take no six months to get unhooked. No. No. No, it doesn't. Just don't buy it no more. <laughs> That's right. Amen. When I first heard the word, I just stopped sinning. I stopped all of it. Stop it. My amen. wife, she'll tell you, she would testify. She said, I remember. And she would, I'd give her the mic. She said, yeah, he came to church. He didn't have all that long hair. Mm-hmm. He did it like a fire truck, just like an ambulance, just like you said, with all them loud colors. Yeah. yeah, he sat up on that front row shaking his hair. <laughs> and yep, I didn't pay him no mind either. All of that was true. All of but true. that Sunday night, he came back. Uh-huh. He came, one, came in one way, left, and came back another man. Amen. I had to, I had to, I had to. I had to take, I had to, amen, take my testimony back when I said, oh, that young man ain't going to do nothing. He's too cute. Don't got cute you think you are. Mm-hmm. Even you got a love for the truth, yes. you'll put your cuteness down. Oh, yeah. And oh, become yeah. what God wants you to become. That's right. I heard, be ye holy, for I, I am holy. holy. Yeah. That's what I was looking for all my life. All your life. Didn't know what my purpose was in earth till I came here. Amen. When I came here, I heard the truth, uh, Pastor. Yeah. yeah. Be holy. That sounds like the right thing to the do. The right thing to do. Hallelujah. Amen. Now, amen. I yeah. put away my sins. Mm-hmm. 
young man. Amen? Amen. Watch the word. Read it. No, you're not. Don't you know this? That so many of us. That so many of us. As we're baptized into baptized Yahshua the Messiah. In Yahshua Messiah. We're baptized you know into his you death. baptized in his death. Amen. And my, 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 uh, my wife, a uh, nephew, passed. Mm -hmm. yeah. We're going to be burying him sometime soon. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We ain't going to see him no more. Mm -mm. No more. Okay, how much you love him? Even once we die. Not coming Amen. Back. As we're not coming back. Mm -mm. Not coming back. That's it. When people die, you'll never see them again. His book oh. is that on how bad you want to see them. It don't matter. Book your, is in your imagination can play tricks on you too. Tomorrow you yeah. did see them. Mm. Right, that's just your imagination. We, we know better. Yeah. We know better. Yeah. We know you didn't see them. You didn't. just miss them real bad. Yeah. yeah. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes. Yeah. But once a person dies, yeah. hallelujah. Book is closed. It's over with. The book is closed. Amen. You'll never see them again. Mm -mm. Don't you know that you was we that was baptized in the name of Yeshua that you old we're man was buried? In his death. Don't y'all know we're baptized in His death? Amen. Amen. World shouldn't see you no see more. See you no more. Huh? Yeah. The world should never hear your voice no more. Amen. When your lips move now, it's the Lord speaking in you. Yes, that's right. That's right. That's right. It's all about His will. All about His will. All about what He want of you. Amen. Amen. That's right. If they see you that, amen, once you're born again, even mama won't recognize won't you. Won't recognize your you. Your daddy won't recognize you. Your best friend won't recognize you no more. That's right. Don't you know if they recognize you, that means you come alive. Amen. Yeah. You're not dead. Uh-huh. Because if you're, if you're dead, then your life is hid in the Messiah. Oh, yeah. Hey, mom. Amen. The world don't know me no more. No. Amen. Don't know me. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. That's right. Oh, y'all listen to me. Yes. I said the world don't know me anymore. Mm-hmm. No more. Amen. My wife, amen, when she went over to my sister's house, and my sister was doing her hair, mm -hmm. and there was a woman that said, I know Junebug. Yes. She even said, I had a crush on him. <laughs> she told that to my wife. But one thing I tell you about him, yeah. he wasn't like people thought he was. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. He wasn't like all these other men, boys growing up, babies here, babies there, baby there. He, he didn't do all that kind of stuff. Amen. Now, one reason I didn't do it because I was scared. I didn't know if you was a man or a woman. <laughs> <laughs> I saw that magazine. Uh -huh. They had all like 12 women in a bathing suit. And they said, which one of these, these women is a man? <laughs> and the one I said, I know it's not a man. I said, I know this not no man. I mean, uh, you know, and it was. From that point, mm -mm, I don't care how good you look like in the, in the club. I'm not, you're not going home with me. I don't know you. <laughs> so coming to church was the best thing that ever happened to me. I come running. I come running to church. I ain't trust nobody. Nobody. When I saw that, when I saw that, when I saw that photo, and I said, I know it's not her. And it was. I was scared to death of women ever uh, since. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I go to club. Can I have to dance? I don't know you. I dance with my sister. I dance with my sister. Amen. I dance with my sister. That's right. People I knew, I grew up went to school with. <laughs> so when I come to church and the words say, be holy, I, I do it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Somebody says, it's safe to serve God. I said, oh, yeah, I, yeah, I serve. <laughs> Hallelujah. Yeah. Oh, y'all listen to me, brother and sister. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes, he said, right. one thing I have to say about June Buck. He was for real when he got in church. Amen. Mm -hmm. Yeah. He was for real when he got in church. Yeah. He was young. Mm -hmm. He let everything go. Amen. And I haven't seen him since. Mm -hmm. So she looked at my wife and said, you got a good person, a good man as a husband. Mm -hmm. Are y'all listening to me, brother? Yeah. It's the word that makes you good. That's, That's right. right. You're not good without the word. You, you oh, no. Nobody trusts you without the word. No. Mm -hmm. right. Hallelujah. Yeah. My mama don't trust daughter without the word. She crazy without the word. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Father don't trust his son without the mm -hmm. word. No, without the word. word. Hallelujah. That's right. You know, without the Lord, without the word, you, you're not trustworthy. Not at all. Just say one thing and go do something else. Amen. 
Yeah. Are y'all listening to me this morning? Amen. Uh -huh. What it says there? Amen. No, you're not. Don't you know? That so many of us as were baptized. So many of us that was baptized. Into Yahshua the Messiah. Into Yeshua the Messiah. Were baptized into the, his you death. You were baptized into his death. Therefore, yes. we are buried with him. Don't you know you're supposed to be buried by with him? By baptism into what? death. By what? By baptism by, into we, death. We're supposed to be buried with him. Amen. You shouldn't be living no more. Amen. No longer. Amen. I don't care how much you like smoking. Right. You, you're born again. Never you're dead. You're old. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Somebody that died naturally yeah. so. Uh -huh. You put him in a casket and you can fill his casket up with Winston all you want to. All the way to the rim. <laughs> Marlboro. Fill you fill Marlboro. it up with Marlboro. Yeah. Huh? Mm -hmm. uh, cool. Uh -huh. Yeah. Newport. Hallelujah. Camels. Newports. Newports. Uh, Newports and old ports. And <laughs> yeah. You know what? Beaties. Huh? You can, <laughs> hey, man, he won't touch none of them. Not a single one. No, I said he won't touch none of them. He won't, he won't Stick one in his mouth and light it. He still ain't going to inhale it. No, he ain't. Why? Because the man is dead. He's yeah. dead. D-E-A-D, -E dead. Yeah. And when you were baptized in the name of Yeshua, amen, amen that means your old man was put to death. That's he right. died. Yes. You don't go to a funeral to bury live people. Uh-uh. You don't go to no grave site to bury live people. Uh -uh. You go there to bury people that don't have no more life. Amen. They serve no more purpose in the earth. That's right. They can't fix another meal for you. Mm. Huh? That's right. They can't do nothing for you, so they're good for nothing. Amen. So what do we do with them? We bury them. Bury yes. Them. If you don't, they're going to stink. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. yes, they will. No matter how much you wash them. Yeah. Yeah. No matter how much you wash them. Mm-hmm. The body started decaying. Decaying. Oh, yeah. You know, when Mother Brenda passed and I went to see her, she was laying there, the body was already decaying. Mm-hmm. It beginning to bu 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 bubble, the blood be coming out of her nose and out of her mouth. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Turn cold. Turn cold. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Much as I hate to see her there. Yeah. A time it came. Yes. And I knew I wasn't going to see her no more. Amen. I knew she'd never come to me. I would go to her. Go but she would her. never come to she me. She could never come never to again. me. Never again. Bible says, appointed once unto a man to die. die. And after you die, amen, you're going to be judged. We'll be amen. judged. You're going to be judged for your actions. Yes. You're going to be judged for everything you said and everything you did. That's right. The Lord said, by your words, you're going to be justified. And by your words, you're going to be condemned. condemned. You ain't right. better blame nobody. Amen. If your life messed up, you messed it you up. Messed it up. Amen. You messed it up. Amen. You turned from God. Mm -hmm. Amen. But you was baptized in the name of Yeshua. Yes. You're supposed to be a new creature. Amen. Why are you not being new? Right. Yes. Hmm? Yes. Why are you not walking new? Uh huh. Uh, you listen to me, brother and sister? Yes. Sure. Watch the word, read it. Therefore, we are buried with we, him. It said, it didn't leave you out. It we said are we. buried with him. It didn't leave you out. No. We was buried with him. By baptism, By baptism into baptism death. Into what? Into death. You see, this morning I'm dead. Yes. Oh, so you're not dead, Pastor Why? I see you standing up there. <laughs> I'm talking about my natural man is yeah. dead. Yeah. That old man is dead. Old man. Yes. Hmm? I promise you, you, after service, I ain't going to cuss nobody out like some preachers do. Mm -hmm. Like oh, some yeah. church goers. Go to church, but they'll cuss you out. In a heartbeat. Go to church, and they'll still fight you. Yes. Still fight you. Oh, yeah. Hmm? Mm -hmm. Get through singing Amazing Grace. <laughs> then they turn around and sleep with you. Oh, yeah. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Yeah. But when you're dead, amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes. You, you fight that spirit. Amen. amen. And you talk to yourself, I'm a dead person. Mm -hmm. I don't do that stuff no more. That's right. Don't yeah. get drunk no more. No, Lord. That's right. Hallelujah. Mm -mm. You know how some of us just love our whiskey. Uh huh. Love it. Love it, yeah. love it strong. Mm hmm. Rough and raw. Yeah. Just love it. Oh, yeah. yeah. You smell it right now, King. Right this moment. <laughs> but when you're born again, yes. you know what to do. Amen. They'll never see you drunk again. Never, never see again. you drunk again. That's right. But now you don't drink to get drunk. No, no Lord. We're Everything you do, you're tempering what you do. Amen. Amen. That's right. Amen. Right. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Watch the word. Therefore, we are buried, we with, are buried him with him by baptism, by baptism into, death, into his death. That as the Messiah was raised up from the dead yeah. by the glory of the by Father. What? By the glory of the Father. The Father raised him up. Amen. And no one did it. He did it. He did it. No one stole his body. The Amen. Father raised him up. Even so, we Even also, so we also should walk in the newness of if life. You don't, if you're not walking in a new life, the Father hasn't risen you up. Amen. Don't you know the Father, boy, after he came up out of that water, yeah. you're supposed to be something new. 
That's right. Yes. You have a new life now. Yes. Yes. Amen. You go on the job, you work right. You do the right. You're the only one on the job that yes. does the thing right. Does the right for life. Amen. You ain't be clocking in when you don't supposed to be clocking in. Mm -hmm. You won't have folks. You won't have folks clocking you out when you don't supposed to. Right. You know, you know you're supposed to clock your own self in and your out. Your own self. That's right. That's right. This thing will make a man out of you. Make yes. you be honest and make you be truthful. Yes. Only God can raise men, glorify you. Amen. Right. Raise you up to do that. Yes. That's right. Amen. If you have any honesty in your in your in your bones at all, it's because of God. Amen. At all. At all. Just like mm -hmm. the father raised up the son from the Amen. dead, Even the father so also we. raised us up as well. So, amen. In the newness of life. Yes. You're supposed to be a new life. Have amen. A new life. That's right. Yes, Lord. Don't you know you're supposed to have a new life? Mm -hmm. A brand new life. Brand new. Not that old life. Mm -hmm. Done away. That old life is done away with. Amen. In the newness of life. For if we have been planted For together. If we have. It says, see, see what it says? We, it says we. we. If, that's an if, that two-letter word, two-letter word. If we. I am. If. If. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. if we. Have been planted together. Don't, don't you know we are planted together? In the likeness of in his death. In the likeness of his death. We shall be also. That's why I don't go out there and steal no more. Amen. That's why I don't get drunk and get mm -hmm. high. Uh -huh. oh, man, I, maybe that's one I, I, I was about to say. I don't know when he like weed much as I did, but. Uh, I loved it. <laughs> Yeah, I know, another drug I know. Hey, man. <laughs> Hallelujah. Yeah. But I, I just to love my weed. Yeah, I loved mm -hmm. it. I smoke that stuff every morning. Every day, mm -hmm. all day long. All day. Smoke yeah. it every morning. Yeah. Hey, man. Wake and bake, they called it. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> I smoke weed and ate all day. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. That was a lie. <laughs> So Sit there and smoke a whole bag of weed and go to Taco Bell and eat tacos like I never had it before. <laughs> <laughs> the best thing ever. <laughs> yeah. And happy too. I remember just smiling. Mm -hmm. Everything made me laugh. No worries. Everything. Yeah, everything was great. Sit there and get hot, you know, get in the smoke and just talk about people and laugh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Just, yeah, just, yeah, just, just, just talk about people. No problem. But then I came here. My ears heard words that they had never heard before. That's right. I was, yeah. I was, I was 20 years old. 20. Mm -hmm. At that stage, when a young man ready to kick up his the heels. Prime yeah. The prime. the prime of his life. Prime of his life. He's going to Las Vegas and everywhere else. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But I didn't get a chance to do all that because I came to church at the age 20. Yeah. And I heard the word. Mm hmm. I knew that this is where I was going to yes, spend the rest of my life. Yeah. After hearing this word, I knew this is what I was going to do for the rest of my life. Amen. I had a purpose of living. Yes, Lord. I wanted God to reign in me. Amen. I wanted him to use me. Mm -hmm. I, I wanted him, I wanted to show the world that I don't care how big a sinner you are. Yeah. How big of a devil you may be. Mm -hmm. There's one that can help. That can Amen. Help. One that can save and deliver. Yes. Amen. Right. All that stuff I thought I couldn't get rid of uh -huh. after hearing this. Yes. Yeah. And with no problem. Amen. Hmm? Hallelujah. Yes. I went home and got rid of the weed. I didn't mm -hmm. smoke the bag up, then repent it. <laughs> <laughs> I got rid of the got rid of the weed. Yeah. Hmm? Yes. Stop getting drunk. Yes. Uh -huh. Stop mm -hmm. my line and all the stuff I did. Yes. Yeah. Got wanted to be baptized. Mm -hmm. So I can be born again. Born again. Amen. So I can start all over, my life all over. Yes, Lord. Amen. Is that right? Yes. Amen. Watch the word. Read it. Amen. Therefore, we are buried we with, are him, buried with, with him, him by baptism by into death. By baptism into death. That as the like the Messiah was raised up from the dead. Yes, my Lord. By the glory of the Father. Let, let give Yahweh the glory. Even so, we also. Oh, only he can have you. Yes. Someone look at you and say, you got a changed person. You say, I give God all the glory. All mm -hmm. the glory. All of it. I never thought you'd stop doing that. I give Yahweh all the glory. Mm -hmm. That's right. You know, when they, amen, when, when you let Yahweh redeem you, then people say, there is a God. There is a God that uh, can change you. That's yeah. what they say about you. Ooh, oh, you? Yeah. You change? You change? Yeah. You did what? Uh-huh. Hallelujah. You, power. You, you, didn't, you, you, you didn't have to go enter to some uh, rehab. hospital, rehab? Mm -hmm. You did what? Turkey. You went to church and you heard what? Uh -huh. Yeah. That's right. You mean just that alone? 
Yeah, one night. Yeah, one night. Yeah, one face. That's what Madeline was saying. She said she heard the word one time. One time. And she went on and got rid of her makeup. Went ahead. Yeah. Huh? Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. It didn't take her two weeks to get rid of the blush and six weeks to get rid of the lipstick. Uh uh. All of it, one time. 12, 12, 12 weeks to get rid of the uh, uh, a, a contact that is blue because you got brown eyes. Mm -hmm. Right. A year and a half to get rid of the nail polish. Uh -huh. Hallelujah. Amen. She didn't wean herself off. Amen. Right. The Bible said that God said, the day you hear my voice. Today. Don't harden your heart. The day that you hear my voice. Don't you harden your heart. Don't you harden your heart. There's a day of trouble. Mm -hmm. Don't harden your heart. You know what I'm saying is right. You. you know you need me in your life. You know Amen. you do. You messed up without me. Don't harden your heart. Hallelujah. Amen. Don't be like the children of Israel in the wilderness. Amen. Don't right. harden your heart. Amen. Hallelujah. That's right. But repent. Yes. Turn from the eve of your ways. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Choose life. Amen. 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 That's right. Watch the word. Read it. Amen. Therefore, yes. we are buried with him by baptism into death. Thank you, Yahweh. That as like the Messiah was raised up from the dead Thank by the you. glory of the Father, right. even Father. so we also should walk in the newness we, of life. We should. Should. Someone said, well, I'm not, but I'm here to tell you should. We also should. Not walk that you don't know. You know what's right to do. Oh, yeah. You should walk in the newness of in life. In this new life. For if we've been planted right. together, if we're planted together in the likeness, in the of, likeness his death, of his death, we shall be also in the likeness of his just resurrection. Like him in the resurrection. Amen. He went down flesh. flesh. One thing went in the cave. Flesh went in the cave, mm -hmm. but the spirit came out of the cave. That's right. Flesh went in that water. When you came mm -hmm. out that water, you're supposed to be a new creature. New creature. A, a walking in the spirit now. Amen. You don't do those things you used to do. Mm -hmm. You don't go those places, amen, you used to go. No, Lord. Those friends you used to have, you don't, don't have, have no more. We sang a song. It's a great change since I've been born. It's a great change, Lord, since I've been born. It's a great change since I've been born. It's a great change since I've been born. Oh, the places I used to go home, I don't go no more. And the friends I used to have, I don't have no more. That old life I used to live, Lord, I don't live no more. It's a great change since I've been born. That's how it's supposed to be. Yeah. Yeah. It's going to be a great change. A great change. Hallelujah. She'll see life on you, not death. Amen. I look at the world, nothing but death. That's it. The Bible says, she that liveth in pleasure. She's dead while she's living. She's dead while she's living. Don't realize you're dead. Right. Living in pleasure. Mm-hmm. Won't give yourself to the most high. Right. Live for him. Mm-hmm. Then you're already dead. Just already. Don't know it. Dead already. Amen. Dead man walk. Is that one morning you're not going to wake up? One Amen. morning. Because your ways, hallelujah. Yes. Which are evil and wicked in the sight of the most high God. Mm -hmm. You've been baptized. You know better. Right. You're taking a chance. Mm-hmm. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Amen. Come on, read. For if, we've been, if we have been planted together if in the likeness of his death, we shall be also in the likeness of his resurrection. We shall also be in the likeness of his resurrection. Knowing this, knowing this, that our old man is crucified old, with him. Our old man what? Is crucified with him. Our old man is what? Crucified with him. Our old man is what? Crucified with him. Is crucified. Yeah. Not, not even our old man is supposed to be crucified. Crucified with, with him. Crucified. That our old man should be crucified. I mean, put to death. Put to Amen. Death. Uh -huh. yes. Crucifixion means that you've been put to death. Amen. Our old man. Yes. That wicked one. Is crucified. That sinful with him. one. The one that caused all the troubles and all give us all the headaches in our life. Mm -hmm. You ain't got enough sense to put them down. Amen. 
You've been baptized in the name of Yeshua. Mm -hmm. Don't you know your old man's supposed to be dead? Amen. Yeah. With his deeds. With the deeds. Yeah. What's your old man doing over there? Amen. Uh -huh. yeah. The old place. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Right. Yeah, read. Knowing this, mm -hmm. that our old man is crucified with him. With him. That the body of sin oh my God. might be destroyed. You know why I said might be? Might be. You know why I said might be? Uh-huh. It's something you got to do. do. You got to do. Amen. Hit that and cry you want to. Mm -hmm. you know your life is a mess. You know it is. You ain't got enough sense to repent. Amen. You turn to the most high God. That's right. Cast down, expect God to do something for you. He don't do nothing for you. Amen. He don't do nothing for no one that don't want, who won't repent. Amen. You right. surely die in your sin. Yeah. yeah. Surely said, except you shall believe that I am that He. I am He. You He that come to save sinners. Yeah. Amen. If you don't believe that I am He, that you will surely die. Surely in die your in sin. Your sin. Amen. Amen. Are you listening to me? Amen. Y'all getting this this morning? Yes, Lord. He that has the ear to hear, let him hear. Let him hear. Amen. What the Spirit says to the churches. Yes, Lord. Read that again. Yeah. Knowing this, yes. that our old man is crucified with him. With him. That the body of sin uh -huh. might be destroyed. And he said, might, Yeshua can't help you. Amen. Yeah, he, he, hallelujah. Yes. He's not going to man force you to put them, them, them cigarettes down. You got to put yeah. them down because he told you to put them down. Amen. All right. Huh? Yeah. He's going to force you to live right. Amen. Oh. You got to live right because that's what he wants you to do. He, he said, be ye holy for I am holy. Be ye. That's what he told you to do and you never change. That's right. Everybody in prison seek the Lord, don't you? <laughs> Everybody. Everybody. Boy. Can't get them to pick up no Bible when they're outside. No. They got their freedom. Yeah. They're ready to go pick up something that's not good for them. Right. Yeah. But get locked up in jail and then they want to pray. Yeah. Mm. And, and the Bible says God know we know that God don't yeah. hear no yeah. sinners. God, God don't hear sinners. sinners. He don't. That's right. God don't hear people that ain't right. That's right. The Bible says face is turned from them. It's against them that does evil. The eyes of the Lord is over the righteous. His ears are open to their prayers. But the face of Yahweh is against them that do evil. And you wonder why stuff ain't right in your life. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Won't do right. Doing evil. That's right. Evil Been baptized in the name of Yeshua. And don't he might know the truth and won't walk up right. You ain't going to never have nothing. You'll never, never. mount up anything without That's him. Right. Never. Never. And won't be saved. Your mama can't save you. No. Your daddy can't save you. Cannot. Your brother can't save you. Your Cannot. sister can't save you. Cannot. Your, hallelujah. The Bible says save yourself. From save yourself. yourself. From this untoward generation. That was it. We live in that time that generation don't want, to do, don't want God. They don't want God. They see themselves dying and won't even turn to God. Amen. That's the time we're living in. Mm -hmm. yeah. Love themselves. Men love themselves more than they love oh, God. They love God. The Bible says the Spirit speaking expressly. Mm -hmm. Then the last time, men would depart from the truth uh -huh. and give heed to doctrines of the devil, seducing spirits and doctrines of the devil. devil. You know, Satan here to seduce you. Yeah. Tell you, amen, you can't be holy. You can't live without this. You can't live without that. Why would you believe the devil? Why you won't believe the one that can help you? Satan don't care nothing for you. At all. Amen. Believe him. Yeah. Uh -huh. Why Madeline, she y'all heard her testimony. <laughs> Amen. When she heard the word about the makeup, she said she went home and got rid of all of it. Got rid of it. Amen. She did exactly what I did. When I heard the word, I got rid of my drugs. Yeah. Uh-huh. Got rid of all my fancy clothes. Yes. Hmm? Right. Everything that was contrary to God's will, I got rid of it. Yeah. I stopped immediately. Uh-huh. Immediately. Yes. I didn't want it no more. Amen. All I want to do is do that what's right. Amen. I want to please God. Please him I, I don't want to be them people going around talking about how I love God, but won't do nothing he say. Amen. Amen. Let, right. let people talk. Yeah, I love the Lord. Well, the Lord said, if you love me, you will, you you will, will keep my commandments. You don't have to think about it. You don't go home and think about mm -hmm. this. No. The Lord said, if you love me, you will keep you my will. commandments. That's right. That's what he said. Well, I love the Lord. Without uh -huh. Amen. Show me what I need to do. Well, mm -hmm. I kept it. Got rid of it. Yes. Hallelujah. Came holy. Yes. He had blessed me ever since. Yes, Lord. I got Hallelujah. up this morning in my right mind. Right mind. Oh, yeah. I laid down with the right mind. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Now, yes. speaking expressly. Read. 
knowing this, mm -hmm. that our old man is crucified with him, yeah. that the body of sin might be destroyed. It might because you got to do something. Amen. That sin in your body ain't going to be destroyed. That's but y'all right. Mother Mary testimony. She says, I'm the oldest one in the church. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. She said, but I can't even trust my own flesh. <laughs> no confidence in the flesh. See, I know y'all look at us old folk thing. We don't go through stuff. Mm. Mother Mary will fight you without the Lord. For real. <laughs> oh, yeah. She won't care nothing about you. She don't care nothing about you, I'm telling you. That's right. She'll use that plot board on you. <laughs> Two by four, too. Two by four. Whatever. So will. Whatever your yeah. hand can hold. Uh -huh. And a muzzle can pick up. <laughs> she will whack you with. <laughs> oh, yeah. That the body of sin might be destroyed. The Bible said that the body of sin might. might be destroyed. How the, the, the sin in your body, how it's going to be destroyed when you won't obey. That's right. When you won't turn from your wrongdoing. Amen. That's why it says might. Amen. If the body, if the sins in your body haven't been destroyed because you're not dead. Mm, you're not dead. Bottom line. That's right. Still living somewhere. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. You may look like you're dead, but we know that you're not dead. Amen. Hmm? Amen. Come on, read. That henceforth, yes. we should not serve sin. Y'all hear the Bible talking? Yes. I mean, from now on. We should no. not serve sin. He's baptized in the name of From now on. We should not don't serve care, sin. And don't, don't get me wrong. I ain't saying you don't want to sin. Don't want That's to. That's a lot of things my flesh want to do. Want to do. Lots of things. Cry to do. I'm just telling you. That's something more than that. Just, hmm. I can use a, a, you know, a puff. Oh, just a, just a few? A or two? Just a, I'm all, I don't want the whole bag. Just, just one yeah. joint. I need some happiness in my life. The, the Too much stuff going on. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. I need a little relaxation. Need, need I need to relax a little bit. Ease your just mind. Just an hour or two. Yeah. yeah. Got to ease my mind. I need to <laughs> ease my mind. And only Mary Jane can do it. Yeah. <laughs> she was mighty. Mighty. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you something, when I get up, I don't feel no spirit nowhere. 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 That's the truth. Tempted with adultery. Uh-huh. Tempted with adultery. Yeah. You know, you can commit adultery without touching folks. Right. Mm -hmm. right. I'm on my phone. And, man, go that one with that baby suit. Uh-huh. There you go. I'm at home by myself. Yeah. Uh -huh. And she's looking at me. She's looking at looking. me. And I'm Straight looking at her. I'm not going to get no victim. I'm saying, stop looking at me. <laughs> I said, quit uh, looking at me. Uh, you know I ain't going to do that. I, that no, that's not how you fight. No. Yeah. It's not going to work. Like a brother from New Mexico. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man. You want to have to, hey, man, you want to flip that. Move on. Oh, yeah. yeah keep get out of it. You got hey, man. Amen. And then the next one pop up like they can keep on flipping. Keep on yeah. Yeah. You find a sister in our modest apparel. A uh, brother in his mind of the parents that yeah. thank y'all wait for the church. Amen. Yeah. That's how you overcome. That's <laughs> uh -huh. how you fight your battle. That's right. That's how you fight your battle. Uh -huh. I still had Michael sing that song this morning. Uh -huh. This is how I fight my battle. Oh, yeah. You know, she came to church with a testimony. Yes, yeah, she did. You know, how did she, amen? Yeah. She's been fighting. Oh, yeah. So, she, I want my little Michael to sing, this is how I fight my battle. Mm -hmm. And you know she was fighting how she oh, came yeah. up here. Yeah. Told us how she fought. And provoking us, talking about she got a long testimony. Yeah. <laughs> Mind if I take my time. <laughs> Mind if I take my time. I got some. <laughs> I, yeah, no, I'd rather see a sister who ain't man walking the right, take her time, you know, to give her testimony. And somebody just up and just talking don't mean nothing they talking about. Yeah, we don't want you to take your time. We don't want you to take, we want you to get through, sit down immediately. As James, brother James would say, instantly. Instantly. Yeah, sit down instantly. Hey, man, walk up right and come on, stand before the people and grab a oh, mic yeah. so we can rejoice with you. Yeah. Don't be, as we were saying to the saints of Mexico, don't be a hypocrite. Amen. Say Amen. Saying don't do it. Yeshua would say, you hypocrite. Mm -hmm. You first cast out the beam out of your own eye. eye, that you may clearly yeah. to pluck out the moat that's in the your brother's brother. eye. But how can you say to your brother, amen, let me cast out this uh, uh, moat in your eye when you there's a, a beam, beam in your own eye? eye. You hypocrite. Hypocrite. That's what he said. Yeah. That's what he told his disciples. That's what he said. Don't be a hypocrite. Mm -mm. You going to follow me, amen? Uh, and then walk upright. Amen. Yeah. Turn from the eve of your way. Yeah. Hallelujah. Amen. Turn from the evil of your ways. That's right. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Yes. Bible says when one sinner repents, the heavens heaven rejoice. rejoice. Can't be no hypocrite. You don't make heaven rejoice. Amen. Right. You got to repent. You got to turn from your ways. Yes, so Lord. Don't, one day, don't you know this man here, mm -hmm. this evil, wicked person, by myself, I did it that day. 
Yeah. I made heaven rejoice. Amen. Because I repented. Yes. And I turned from my sin. For the first time, I made heaven be proud of me. Yes. yes. All that stuff I was doing, heaven wasn't proud of me at all. Mm. Yes. All those angels, I can call them down, since I know the truth, was always in the presence of God. I said, let me smack them. Uh, let me, let me take them out right now. Yeah. I'll do it, Lord. i do it. Let me, let, let, let me move them out. Yeah. You won't see their wickedness no more. Just let me have them. Uh -huh. You hear this morning? Yeah. Yeah. God been good to you. That's Amen. right. He's been merciful. Yeah. Merciful. And we both oh, yeah. know you don't deserve to see this day. Not at all. No way. You should have never have woken up this morning. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. That's right. That's right. Hallelujah. Amen. Now you can show that you appreciate it by repenting. Yes. That's right. And turning from your sin. Amen. And let him live in you. Yes. Not the devil. That's right. Amen. Satan didn't create you. God mm -mm. did. God did. God created you in his image. Yes. After his life. Yeah, God wants you right. to be like him. Amen. Don't you, the Bible said, don't you know we are the temple of the Holy Ghost? Mm. Uh -huh. Paul said, shall I take this temple and make it a temple, make it a harlot, uh -huh. uh -uh. make it a whore? No. Is that what we're supposed to do? Yeah. Take the temple and make it a harlot? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. No. Amen. No. God created, this, created you so he can live in you. Amen. 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 That's why he created you. Yes. Yeah. You didn't buy them clothes just to look at. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> and you didn't, no one went to the store and bought them clothes just to look at. Amen. You bought them clothes Amen. to wear. That's right. To put on, right? Amen. Mm? Amen. Hallelujah. Yes. Well, God created you. Uh-huh. No, to live in you. Hallelujah. To reign in you. Amen. Not Satan. That's right. Satan don't care nothing about you. Not at all. He can't go to heaven. He kicked out. He can't go to heaven. He don't want you to go there neither. Mm -mm. There's no hope for him. There's no hope for him, but hope Amen. for you. As long as you breathe, then you can have an opportunity. That's right. To turn from your wrongdoing. Amen. Amen. Don't say you can't do it. There's too many folks. You know it's doing it. Oh, yeah. Now, you, have, you have enough witnesses. Enough you, witnesses. You, we all know a lot. We, we know Cloud people in this way that are very bad. Mm. Very bad people. Yeah. We're very bad people. Oh, yeah. But some of us who are so bad. Amen. Made up my mind to serve the Lord. Amen. So now the Lord reign in us. Yes. Watch the word read it. That henceforth. That from now on. We should not serve sin. I don't care what sin. you did yesterday and last night. Amen. I don't care. I don't even want to talk about it. That's right. We should, we not, should not serve sin. Serve sin. Mm -hmm. For he that is dead. He that is dead. Is freed is from free. sin. Don't y'all know I'm free this morning? Yes, Lord. I'm free from sin. Amen. I said, I'm free from sin. Yes, I am. Yes. If you're dead, you're free from sin. Amen. Sin don't have no more have no power over you anymore. Mm -hmm. God, and don't get me wrong. I didn't say you don't want it. Sin. I said you're free from it. Right. Amen. Hallelujah. You're not gonna go back to it. Right. Because the Lord has set you free. Amen. He's your blessing going out and coming in now. Right. I'm gonna write about that. Amen. Yeah. Now if we be dead. Now if we be dead. With the Messiah. With him. We believe that we shall also live with him. You got to believe that if you hold fast to this teaching, it's going to help you. Amen. Amen. You go around and cry all you want to, but you all ain't, you 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 ain't going to find no help. You'll never change. Amen. You'll never get better in your life. Never. You ain't, you ain't, you ain't noticed that yet? Mm. You ain't noticed that yet? Amen. Without, without God, you nothing. You nothing. You'll never be nothing. You'll never, never have be. anything. Well, don't you won't know be. That? Don't you realize that? Amen. Only he can take something that is nothing. Amen. And make something out of it. That's right. Only he can do it. Amen. The Bible says, Lord is our help. Yes. He helped me. In a time of trouble. To be what I am today. Amen. Because of him, I stay out of trouble. That's right. I have to worry about no prison because I don't do nothing that amen that's going to send me there. not going to send me there. Hallelujah. Amen. Are you listening to me? Yes. Because of him. Amen. Glory. Come on, read. Knowing that the Messiah, being raised from the dead, mm -hmm. dieth no more. He didn't die no more. Death has no more he dominion did, over him. He have no more dominion. For in that he died, yes. he died unto sin once. Mm -hmm. But in that he liveth, yes. he liveth unto God. Now you're supposed to be dead. Amen. The world shouldn't see you no more. That's you, right. You can't keep on dying. Amen. You know, before we knew God, we go sin all day long, right? All day. Then at the night, and at the night time, before we lay down, we get on our knees oh, yeah. and pray that prayer. Uh-huh. Our Father, which are in heaven, I be thy name. Like, amen. 
I, I, you know, uh, what's that, that prayer we used to sing? Oh, now, now, yeah. Now unto him. Yeah, that one. We didn't pray to the other one. <laughs> now unto him. Uh -huh. Now I lay, lay my down. I lay me down. It's been so long, brother. And sister, I forgot how it goes. But now some of y'all still doing that. Anyway, uh, 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 what about you getting your daughter in law to do? <laughs> you ain't gonna be stuck out there. <laughs> now there uh, you on your own, Pastor. <laughs> now I lay me down to sleep. I pray, I pray the Lord, Lord my soul to keep. If, if I, I should die, die before I wait, I pray, I pray the Lord my soul to take. take. You going to hell. He I'm going to let you know right him. now. <laughs> you lost. He ain't going to take you. He yeah, he's going to take you and cash you into the lake yeah. and burn with fire and brimstone. Drop That's what he's going to do. Amen. You can't play the devil all day long then come to God at night and pray that prayer and think he's going to have mercy on you. Uh -huh. you gonna drop you off in the, lake. the Bible said God is not marked. Not marked. <laughs> you know, Michelle, you know, she had talked about her husband. The testimony said it, it was him. He was, she was true to him. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Yeah. But she said, I'm not marked. You ain't yeah. going to do me like that. Yeah. So she got back at him. Yeah. You can't mark God. You ain't going to play a sinner all day long. Uh -uh. Wait, you ain't made you on your deathbed and have him right. forgive you. Yeah. You need to stay away from them Catholic churches. Because <laughs> that surely ain't going to happen. Uh -uh. It don't work that way. No. Mm. Hallelujah. Everybody on that plane, when that engine quit on that plane, everybody get religion, don't they? Oh, yeah. Real Even quick. the people that say there is no God. Right. When that engine quit the and that plane turned upside down, it's coming down. Mm -hmm. The one that says that there is no God, he's calling on God. Oh, yeah, when they in trouble. Yeah. I, was on, I remember I was on that plane. I forgot where I was coming from. And these folks on there, especially some young people, they, you know, young people, they crazy, they ain't got no sense. <laughs> especially without the law in their life. Mm -hmm. Yeah, y'all, they're, they're making fun of God and all this kind of stuff. And I'm just listening to them. I'm looking at them. Mm -hmm. My soul was vexed. Mm -hmm. The Bible talked about lots of that just man. Yes. No sin, they evil deeds vex his soul day oh, by day. Amen. And my spirit was vexed. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Yeah. And I talked to the Lord about what they was doing. And we hit an air pocket. And mm -hmm. that plane dropped. Yeah. I mean, it dropped. Uh -huh. Everyone that was in seat belt down, <laughs> they went up. Amen. Cokes and cookies and crackers and peanuts and everything else flew. Mm. I put my seat belt on because I knew y'all were going to do something. <laughs> I, that all they had at the thing, you know, you can you know, unloose your seat belt. Uh -huh. But I kept mine on because there was too, too many fools on that plane. Uh -huh. But I knew I was going to be all right, and I knew they were going to be all right, too. Uh -huh. so they were with me, like those men with Paul on that ship. Amen. Oh, yeah. Hallelujah. Amen. And the Lord told Paul, and he sent an angel, said, now one of them would die. Oh, but I'm going to get their attention, though. Amen. Hallelujah. Yeah. And we hit that air park, and that plane dropped. And when it dropped, he forgot to holler and cry. Lord. And it dropped. And after the, it talked back up, it was quiet. I mean, nobody was saying nothing. I just said, thank you, y'all. Well, you know how to shut the mouth of oh, the yeah. heathens. You know how to shut the mouth of the oh, yeah. heathens. You know, how to do you know how to make the wicked be quiet. Oh, yeah. And it was quiet. I was able to close my eyes and meditate. <laughs> then once the plane landed, you know what everybody did? Kissing the ground. Started right. clapping their hands. Going back. And went back to their wickedness. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you, you knew we were going to die playing with each other again. Well, yeah, that's all right. Yeah. They're judging. Y'all gonna know it was a holy man on that plane Amen. that y'all didn't pay attention to. Right. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 me talking about this? Yes, Lord. That's how I bless you when you walk upright. Amen. Yahweh with you. Amen. If I wasn't on that plane, they probably would have died. Went down. Every one of them. Oh yeah. But because I was on that. Mm -hmm. Amen. To God with His people. Oh yeah. He's He's a, He's a, He's their protector. Oh, yeah. So all those men were with Apostle Paul on his ship because mm -hmm. of Paul is why they survived. Amen. Are, are you listening to me? Yes. Come on, let's finish it. Likewise, reckon you also yourselves. You need to understand. To be dead indeed you under sin. Be dead to sin. Amen. Because your body want to go do wrong, don't mean you're supposed to go do it. Amen. When are you going to stop all of that? Right. You're supposed to be dead to it. Mm hmm. Dead now, indeed right. under sin. Dead indeed, indeed. I indeed. Know sometime he did, saying. sometime every day. Indeed. All day long. Amen. Amen. 
Come on, read. Likewise, reckon you also yourselves to be dead indeed unto sin. Read it. But alive unto God. But alive to what through God. Through Yahshua the Messiah, our Lord. Alive to what God wants. Amen. Through what Yeshua have given unto us. Amen. Yeshua have shown us how to, how to please the Father. That's right. Yeah, read on. Let not sin therefore don't, reign don't. in your mortal body. You better do something with that sin. Let not. You got to get rid of it. You better do something. That's right. Some I mean, you need to pray. Yes. Some I mean, of you need to go on a fast. You better, you better mm -hmm. do something with that sin. You don't Amen. do something with it, you're going to sin. Amen. Don't let it rain. In your mortal body. In your, your messed up flesh. That you should obey it in the lust should thereof. obey your lust. Amen. Come on. Neither yield you your Don't members. You yield your eyes. As instruments your feet, unto unrighteousness. Your ears, your finger, your, your tongue, your, your mouth. Those are your instruments. Amen. Un of unrighteousness unto sin. You don't sin. use your instrument to do the wrong thing with it. Amen. Your, tongue, your breasts, your legs. Yes. yes. You don't yield your instruments Amen. to do wrong things with it. Amen. You can't trust yourself. No, you can't. Your whole body plumb gross. Oh, man. Plumb nasty. Yes. It's unclean. Yes. Lord. What do you think they were saying about that nasty old man? Yeah. Mm -hmm. dirty, old man. dirty old man. He's yeah. old, but, but he's dirty. He think dirty. Yes, mm -hmm. yes Lord. Yes. Amen. Hmm? Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes. Your instrument. Amen. Neither yield your members as instruments. Him with it. Yes. Yahweh wanted you to with red fingernails. So he would have given you red fingernails. would have gave them to you. I'm born that way. He wanted you to diamond in your nose and in your ear. Mm -hmm. In your belly. Oh, yeah. He would have put nipple. it there. Yeah. Yeah. He would have put one there. Amen. Amen. That's, right. That's right. I don't care how, how, how smooth your legs is. He wants you to cover them up. Amen. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Don't got to run around your cheeks are back there. He, he wants them cover up too. <laughs> Maybe go around showing your cheeks. <laughs> That's right. Cover them cheeks up. <laughs> That's right. Hmm? Yes. Brother, amen. Hallelujah. Mm -hmm. You don't blame no, you don't blow no game. No. No, Lord. Hallelujah. That's right. You're not no game member. Mm -mm. Are oh, y'all listening to me, brothers and sisters? That's right. Your instrument. Amen. Neither yield you Don't members yield as your instruments, instruments of unrighteousness unto, unto, unrighteousness sin, unto sin, but yield yourself unto but God. Use your, you yield yourself to what God wants of your body. As those that are alive from the dead. Alive from the dead. And your members as and instruments members of righteousness to God. unto we God. We know that our body belongs to God. Amen. I'm going to let Yahweh use my body. That's right. To his glory. Amen. Come on, read it. Come For on. sin shall not have it dominion shall over shall you. shall not have dominion. For you are shall not have dominion. Amen. It have dominion over you because you're not right. That's right. But it shall not have dominion over, over you. For you are not and under the law, not under the law, but under grace. But we under grace. What then? Yeah. Shall we sin? I better understand this. Mm -hmm. Because we are not under the law, we not under the law. but under grace. See, under the law, you broke the law. We get chunk rocks at you. Yeah. Oh yeah. You, you know, you're saying you don't come in here. We ain't, we ain't gonna give you no hug. No. No, I'm the law. Yeah. The ain't you. nobody gonna hug you. Yeah. I'm the law. We're gonna chunk some rocks at you. Yeah. We're yeah. gonna drag your little self outside. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. yeah. That's what we're gonna do. Yeah, plenty, Against plenty your will, whether you like it or not. Ain't no need to holler because everybody else is gonna throw rocks too. Oh, yeah. yeah. Help, help. Ain't gonna be nobody help. Yeah, I'm the law. You have to die. Oh, yeah. yeah. Bible says those that despise Moses' law, uh, they die, die without, without mercy. mercy. Yeah. There's no mercy. Here, yeah, uh -huh. we're not under the law, we're in the, in the grace. Yes. Right? Amen. Through Yeshua. So God has to teach us to show you a mercy. Amen. So we don't judge you, we don't condemn you, but that don't make you right because I'm hugging you. Amen. Because I say it's nice to see you. Uh-huh. You still in your sin? Amen. You still a sinner? Mm -hmm. Yes. That don't make you right? Amen. Because, amen, hallelujah, we don't, we don't roll our eyes at you when you every time you sin. Mm-hmm. Right. Hallelujah. Amen. We're not charged to mistreat you. Amen. I don't care how wrong you are. Yes. God still ch uh, charged us to love one another. Amen. Amen. To do unto others as you will have them, them to, to do, do unto, unto you. you. That's what we're taught. Yeah. But that don't make you right because I'm doing you right. Right. Amen. Love your neighbor as yourself. as yourself. That don't make you right. Mm -mm. I'm only doing what God told me to do. <laughs> yes. 
Because you're here this morning don't mean you're right. That's right. But the John said, whether you come out to see, why are you here? Uh, reed shaking what did you come here for? Yeah. yeah. So some people come for the wrong reason. The wrong reason. Yes, Lord. See, man, if you, don't you know you come for the right reason, you don't need no one to say, you know, you need to be listening. That's right. Yeah, that's right. You, you can't be for real. Yeah, you need to pay attention. You need to pay attention. Someone mm -hmm. got to tell you, you need to pay attention. You ain't, hey, man, you're here for some other reason. Amen. Not for not to be right. That's right. The that's the bottom line. Mm -hmm. Yeah, hey, man, you're not going to Waterburger not to eat. <laughs> you go to Waterburger not to eat. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Somebody gonna say something wrong with you. Why are you here? Amen. Amen. People at the, at the, at the work, an employee gonna say, Why are you here? May I take your order? I'm just, I don't want that. I'm just looking. Yeah. Why, why, why are you here? Hallelujah. <laughs> you just can't go in the water break and sit at their they table. Uh uh. And just sit there. No. Uh huh. No people say, well, I'm sorry, ma'am. I'm sorry. So you can you you're not gonna purchase and can you go? Cause we need this table for people that's for purchasing. For paying customers. For paying customers. <laughs> Amen. Only. That's right. How many of you ever been to a theater movie? Mm-hmm. You went there with your money too, did you? Oh, yeah. that, you didn't see no you movie. Ain't in. <laughs> Unless you just you know you were like I did, just snuck in when people ain't watching. Yeah. That that's the only way you did <laughs> the it. The only way. Snuck in, people. go there, no, ain't just sneak in, everybody ain't looking. Mm. Yeah. You devil, you. <laughs> I used to be a devil. I used to do stuff like that. Yeah. I like everything free. Free? Okay. If it's free. It ain't I'm like free. paying for nothing. Uh -uh. Go to Six Flag, jump the fence. Oh, yeah. Go to the fair, sneak over the fence there, too. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Amen. Go to a club, try to sneak in. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Amen. Go to the mall without money to steal. Oh yeah, I'm coming out. I'm coming out with some converts. Mm -hmm. Back then, there wasn't no Jordan back then. Back in those days, was those converts. No one, there was no such thing as Jordan. Mm -hmm. It was some converts. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But I'm born again. Amen. I don't even want the Jordan shoes. Mm. I'm born again. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Yes. I, I don't want the Dallas Cowboy hat and either. I'm mm, born again. I'm amen. not going to wear around. I may watch the game, but I ain't going around with that 88 on my shit. Anyway, <laughs> uh, he, amen? Yeah. I'm not there. My body ain't for that. Amen. I'm tempered in all things. Yes. Hallelujah. I'm not going to promote it. Yes. Hallelujah. Amen. Are you listening to me, brothers and sisters? Amen. Amen? Amen. And I'm not going to cuss folks out when they lose, neither. Mm -mm. <laughs> Go fight them. Hey, amen. Throw something <laughs> at the television. Oh, amen. That's right. Hallelujah. That's right. Ain't going to get up and cook for the kids. <laughs> yeah. My wife called that through another interception. Now the kids got to eat tomorrow. <laughs> you can't watch no football. Lost you don't all. need to be looking at it. That's right. Don't do nothing going to get you wrong. Mm -mm. Nothing should change you. That's right. We're in this world, praise God, but we're not kept by the power of nothing. Amen. That's of this world. That's right. And we, amen. Paul said we're in the world, but we don't misuse the world's good. Amen. We don't take advantage of the world's good. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Amen. Are y'all listening to me, brothers and sisters? Yes. Amen. amen. Y'all hear me talking? Amen. amen. Hallelujah. I got a cowboy watch in my hand, my room. Mm -hmm. In the draw, never wore it. Somebody gave it to me. I forgot that it was there. Amen. amen. Go around. <laughs> Ain't got Jerry Jones money. How about them boys? <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Ain't got none of his money. Hmm? <laughs> I'm a fanatic. You'll never know. <laughs> You'll never know. <laughs> Hallelujah. Yes. Watch the word. Come on, read. What then? What then? Shall we sin because we are not under the law? Amen. Paul asked the church a question. Yeah. Some folks in church sin it. Mm -hmm. Because we ain't going to mistreat you. Amen. Because we're not going to talk about you and run you down. Mm -hmm. That's why you should continue to do the wrong thing. Mm -hmm. Because we're going to love you in the house and act mm -hmm. like you ain't did anything. Mm -hmm. Paul said, God forbid. God forbid. Mm -hmm. Know you not. Don't y'all know. That to whom you yield Whoever yourself you servants yield to obey. Your, so, your body to be a servant. His to. servants you are to whom you obey. Then you are a servant to the spirit that you obey. Whether of sin Whether unto sin death. sin to death. Or of obedience, or obedience unto righteousness. Why is it obedient to righteousness? 
Because in this church, you're going to be told what you can and can't do. Amen. Either you're going to obey it. And you know what? You obey it, you're going to do the right thing. Amen. And God going to bless you. Yes. You don't obey it. Amen. Then you're going to sin. Amen. God ain't going to do nothing for you. None for you. Sometimes he put us in a position where we can't do nothing can't for you. Because you're so disobedient. You. Amen. That's right. Hallelujah. Amen. Are y'all listening to me, brothers and sisters? Yes, Lord. Come on, read. But Yahweh be thanked. Yeah, what? But Yahweh be thanked. Amen. You hear this morning, you ought to be thanking him. Hallelujah. But Yahweh be thanked. That you were the that servants you of were, sin. He said, were not no more. You were. You were a the servant servants of sin. Not no more. Not no more. You ought to thank God for that. Amen. You were. You were the servants you of sin. Not no more. That's right. You know how to keep your body, yeah. make your body walk upright and do the yes. right thing. Yeah. Amen. You are the servant of sin. But you have obeyed from the heart. From how? From the heart. If it's not from the heart, why are you here? Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. What are you doing here? Yes. Your body will never do what's right if the heart ain't right. Amen. Amen. That's true. Cause the cup look clean outside, mm -hmm. don't mean it's clean inside. What about the inside? What's inside gonna get you sick? Amen. Uh, yeah. What goes inside the mouth? You got a water change. Yeah. yeah. You gotta be tired of that old man. You got he ain't did nothing for you. No. The old man ain't never done nothing for you. No. It leaves you empty, it destroys your life. That's, That's it. what the old man does. That's it. it never did nothing good for you. Never. What you left with? Never had. Not your old man. Nobody old man ever did anything good for them. Never. That's right. Hallelujah. You ain't got enough sense to see that? Are mm. oh, you so blind you can't see that? Mm. You want to listen to your old man? Mm -mm. No, Lord. Hallelujah. You need to let him give you life. Amen. The yeah, Bible says give it to you more abundantly. More abundantly. All you got to do, look at those that are obedient. Look, mm. look at the joy they got. Mm -hmm. and look at the peace they have. Amen. And look what you're always doing for them. Yes. You can't be blessed like that because you're not right. Amen. You need their blessing. Yes. That's right. You need their prayer. Yes. How long do you think that's going to last? Mm. So Your day's out. running out. Running out. That's why the Lord said, let the wicked. Forsake his way. Forsake his way. And the unrighteous man. And the unrighteous. You, you think too much. Yeah. You unrighteous folks. You just think too much. You think yourself wrong every time. Amen. You think that you're wise when you're not. When you're not. Right. If you look at yourself in the mirror lately, mm -hmm. you see how much you need the Lord. Amen. I learned that amen over 42 years ago. I looked oh, yeah. in the mirror and I said, this young man needs the Lord. He life. needs him. And he had given me life. Amen. Yeah, bless my More going brother. out and my coming in. Just like he promised. Just like he promised. Amen. Let the wicked forsake their way. And the unrighteous man. And the unrighteous man is talking. And let him return and to the Lord. And let him do what? Return, return to the Lord. Because you won't serve them. What happened to you? Mm -hmm. What happened? What did you do? Right. Uh -huh. hmm? What happened to you? What, what? did you do? Hallelujah. Stop obeying. Let him return. Uh, to the Lord. And he will have mercy upon him. He will him. do what? He, he will, will have, have mercy, mercy you upon him. You don't have to be looking for everybody else's mercy. He'll do it for he you. Will. He will have mercy upon him. You need his mercy, not mine. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. You need his mercy. Amen. And yes. he will have mercy. Upon him and to our God. And to our God. For he will he abundantly. He will do what? Pardon. Abundantly. Pardon. Abundantly. Pardon. For all that wrong you ever it. did. He'll, amen. He won't hold you accountable of it. He'll pardon that for you. Ever did. That's what he have done for me. Amen. Yes. And many others. Amen. Yes, Lord. All you got to do, open your eyes up and look. Yes. And behold the goodness of Yahweh. Mm -hmm. Behold. Open your eyes up and look and see the salvation. Yes. His salvation. Amen. Yes. Only he can yes. give it. That's right. Only he. Did he give it to you? He gave it to me. He gave it to you? He gave it to me. He said you should be a mama boy. Mm -hmm. Mama boy. Oh, yeah. It ain't going to work. Mm -hmm. Mama get food stamps. Yes, you do. Oh, yeah. Amen. Ain't huh? going nowhere. Uh, Hallelujah. Nowhere. Yeah. But the spirit, 
-hmm. You let Cain inherit the word. Yes. Uh -huh. And the spirit gave you life. Amen. Now you, let get, you got some structure. Yes. Now you're a hard working man. Yes. Yes. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Are you listening to me? Amen. And Yahweh bless you going out and you're coming in. Oh, sure does. And you got peace of mind that you never had before. Amen. Peace that only he can give. He can Hallelujah. Amen. And since you have tasted the Lord. Yes. That he is gracious. He is God gracious. is a lively stone. He's Amen. not dead. He's alive. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Are you listening to me, brother and sister? That's right. By a new and living way. Uh -huh. Give you life. Yeah. real. I got life this morning. How many of you got life this morning? Amen. And how many of you want it? True life. Yeah. Well, if you want it, you got to repent. Amen. Come on, come on, verse. But Yahweh be thanked. thanked. That you were the servants you were of sin. The servant of sin. But you have obeyed from the heart. You have come and you heard the that word. form of doctrine. You came and you heard the teaching and you obeyed. Which was delivered that to form you. Form of doctrine. Yes. Which, that, was, which was delivered. Was delivered. To you. That's what you're getting this morning. Amen. That form of doctrine that he taught. Amen. I'm giving it to you this morning. Amen. Ben just gave it to you earlier. Now I'm uh -huh. giving it to you. Yes. Right. He, he cooked the cake and I'm putting icing on it. <laughs> Amen. Ain't no need to have a cake without the icing. Amen. No That's right. You, you'll get mad. Someone bring you a cake without the icing. <laughs> Man. That's right. Especially when you pay for the icing, too. Amen. Yeah. Hello, you're going to take it back to Walmart and say, I, now, I want icing on this cake. Y'all yeah. cheating me. Mm -hmm. That's right. One thing about God, church, it don't cheat. No, it don't. Yeah, hallelujah. It speaks to your heart. Amen. Yes, That's why I love this place. Yeah. Love it. Come on, read it. Being then made. Being then be, free be, made, from made, sin. Made, made, being then made. Yeah. Free from sin. Y'all want to say that? Being, being then, then made. made. Free, free from, from made, 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 free, free from, from sin. Sin. He made, have made me. Sin. I can't speak to everybody else. I'm, I'm, I'm going to have to go out, them, out the doors and the devil going to be waiting on me and I'm going to be waiting on you too. Wait. Yes. Amen. But through him, I've been made free. Free, free from, from sin. sin. I don't care if I pass by a field full of weed. Amen. Full of I'm going to keep on going. Oh, free yeah. <laughs> and at 2 o'clock in the morning, I'm not going to be driving over on that side of the neighborhood uh, to go back down that road just to look at it neither. Yeah. Remember where it's at. I'm um, Free. Free. From sin. Been made free. Made free from free. sin. Been made free. Been made, made free from sin. sin. You became servants you of righteousness. You became servant of, of righteousness. righteousness. If you're doing this reign right because he made you free. Amen. From the sin that your flesh loved doing. That's right. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes. Come on, read it. I speak after the I manner speak of man. After manner. Listen to me. I'm not an angel. I'm not. You can't say, I'm, a, I'm not, I'm a man just like you. Yes. My flesh is no different than your flesh. Amen. Yeah, sometimes I just feel like slapping you too. <laughs> just feel like You think it. you don't want, want to slap? Oh, yeah, no. You ain't the only slapper in the church. You know how to slap. That's right. Yes, that's right. But I'm a man. I speak as a man. Amen. I'm not an angel. No. My flesh is no good neither. Mm -mm. You see me doing right because I, he made me free. Amen. I, I don't want to sin. Amen. My flesh won't. I don't listen to my flesh. That's right. I do what's right to do. Yes. Coming to a man. Mm-hmm. Oh, so I speak as a man. I speak after the manner of men. Just like men. Speak. Because of the affirmity of your flesh. Your, your flesh just got to have it, huh? Mm. Huh? You got to have it. Just got just addicted. Some of y'all addicted to men. Mm -hmm. They can't even look at you without you. Uh -huh. Some of your men afflicted the women like that. Uh huh. Yeah. That's right. Huh? But yes. <laughs> yes, sure. That's how we were. Some of Amen. Uh -huh. Like oh, I yeah. said, I would like to toss out that magazine. <laughs> <laughs> Up until then. <laughs> Up until then. <laughs> Amen. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just saying. Yes. The infirmities. Yes. Of your flesh. You've been giving your flesh what it wants since you've been born. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Turn the lust there. I said, you've been giving your flesh mm -hmm. what it wants since you've been born. Amen. All they know how to do is evil. Because evil. that's all you allowed it to do. By nature. Yeah. By nature. It's evil. By nature, you do those wrong things. Just, mm -hmm. just do it. Amen. You don't care about the consequences. Mm -mm. No. That comes later. Hallelujah. <laughs> After you did it. Yeah. That's right. Amen. Don't care about no consequences. Mm-mm. No. Like men go out to sleep with all these women, have all these babies. They don't care about no feet. No. Uh uh. No. They don't just, just do whatever flesh want to do. Right. Call somebody smile, they want to sleep with them. That's right. Yeah. Amen. Child is born, they disappear. Uh -huh. Mom, they have a baby, don't even want them. 
Right. Uh-huh. Yeah. yeah. Some right. women have maybe just to sell them so they can get some money so they can buy some more drugs. Yeah. That's right. Sell them for drugs. Oh, right. Yeah. I, was yeah. I was watching a movie the other day about that. Mm-hmm. She didn't get nothing about them kids. As long as she can say, man, get pregnant and get some money out of them. Mm. Yep. Yeah. Welfare check. All yeah. that kind of stuff. Amen. Don't care. Mm-mm. No, no natural. Need. These people like that need the law. Amen. Yeah. So they can start caring. No natural. Yes. Affection. No natural. Affection. No, the Bible said not having mm. no yeah, natural affection. affection. No, none, none whatsoever. Yeah, without Amen. Without, without. At the time we're living, when men just don't have no natural, natural affection, affection. Natural about affection. nothing, all they want is what they body want. That's it. That's Amen. It. As long as they got that, that's all they need. They don't mind sleeping on no bridge. Yeah, like a brute beast. Amen. Yeah. As long as they can just feed their flesh. Right. Yeah. What they want. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's right. That's all that matters. That's all that matters. Right. But I'm here to tell you. Amen. That Yeshua is the answer. He is the answer. Amen. The true answer. Hallelujah. Yeah. He's the answer. The real answer. Yeah. He's the answer. You're not going to find me nothing else but in him. Amen. I know. I'm not telling you what someone told me. I'm telling mm-hmm. you out of experience. Experience. I have tried the Lord. And he, yes. I was uh-huh. dead before I met him. Oh, yeah. Uh-huh. He taught me how to walk. Mm-hmm. Yeah. He Amen. taught me how to live. Yes. Yeah. Right. Now I'm living. Yeah, man. Amen. Amen. Yeah. I'm living now. I'm living. This is living. Yeah. Uh-huh. Every morning when I get up, I know what I'm getting up to do. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Amen. I'm getting up to serve him. Amen. To please him in all my ways. Yes. To overcome the wicked one who Amen. wants to root me up. Mm-hmm. Hallelujah. Come to serve him. Yes. The most high. Amen. Amen. One that's been good to me all these years. Amen. One who's been better to me than I've been oh, yeah. to myself. Yeah. Been Any harm that it came upon me, my Any own home. ways have done it. Own ways but it's not him. Amen. Never him. Come on, let's read it, finish it up. I speak after the manner of men because of the infirmity of your flesh. Oh, I know how you are. Amen. I know your flesh. Yes. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. For as you have yielded your members' servants now, to uncleanness yes. and to iniquity, yes. unto iniquity, yes. even so you now you're... from one sin to another. Mm-hmm. You went from marijuana to eight men to ice. Yes. Uh-huh. Went from one man to six. Mm-hmm. One woman to seven. Mm-hmm. 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 Yeah. It went from cousin folks out to fighting them. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Fighting the sheep. Yeah. Uh-huh. Amen. You went from working on the job from stealing from the job. Uh-huh. Yeah. From one iniquity to another. One. Even so now. Now. Yield your members, servants now, to righteousness. It's time to yield your members yeah. to do, to, to be a servant, to do the right thing. righteousness unto holiness. So that you can be holy. Amen. To be holy. Yes. You got to. First, are yielding your members to do the right thing Service in order for you to become holy. That's you right. got to learn to start doing what's right to do. Amen. Make that hand do the right thing. Put that down. You know you ain't got no money to pay for that. Put it down. Put it down. <laughs> That's right. You just, just want to look at it. Hold it. How many times you looked at it and you put it in your, in your pocket? <laughs> looked at it with your pocket. Uh-huh. Yeah. 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 See you you got to quit yielding your, your, sir, your members to do the wrong thing. <laughs> the That's wrong right. Thing. Now, why you want to go down that street? Why? Yeah. You know Sheila lived down there. Yeah. You got a problem with Sheila. Why are you over there? Why? There's no provisions yeah. for your flesh. Amen. That's right. Uh-huh. Y'all getting it? Yeah. yeah. Come on. Even so now yield your members, Come on, you servants to righteousness. You can do it. Unto holiness. Mm-hmm. Yeah. For when you were the servant of sin. Yeah, when you were the servant of sin. Word. You were free you were from free, righteousness. You were free from everything free God from wanted you to do. When you were the servant of the devil, you did have you free from everything God wanted you to do. Amen. Man, it works the other way, man. Amen. Mm-hmm. What fruit yes. had you then in those things? Why are you over there? Why are you doing these things? Whereof you are why, now why, ashamed. Why, why are you getting involved in something that you mean you're going to be ashamed of later on? You know you're going to be ashamed of. Amen. Yeah, it may be pleasant at, at the moment, but at the, at moment. the end of the day when you get caught, mm-hmm. you're going to be shamed. Shame. For the end of those why, things why, is why, death. Why would you do that? Because the end of those things are dead. Amen. Come on, read. But now being made but now free being made, from sin. Now being made free. And become servants free to God. From sin. You become God. servant to God. You have your fruit unto you holiness. Have your fruit unto what? Holiness. holiness. Now your actions is all about pleasing God. And the end of everlasasting life. And because you're pleasing God, you won't find life. 
For the wages of the sin wages is of sin, death. Brother, I'm telling you, doing what your flesh wants, eventually is going to kill you. Amen. Mm -hmm. We're going to look for you. We ain't going to be able to find you. Mm -mm. Because of your life. Amen. Yeah, Come on, read. For the wages of sin the wages is death. Of sin the death. But the gift of God, the gift of God is God. eternal life God, through the Messiah. You, 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 you breathing this morning? Yeah. yeah. I saw you breathing this morning. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Well, it's the gift of God. The gift Amen. God. It is eternal life. I said it's the gift of God. Amen. Amen. All of us sitting here this morning because of God's gift. Amen. Yeah. You have no idea how close you come to death over since the time you over came in this over. world. Amen. Amen. Well, but God kept you. That's right. And predestinated you for this very, very oh, hour. Yes. That's why we all here right now. Amen. Because he predestinated us to be here this morning. Amen. Come on, read. But the gift of God yes. is eternal it's life. Eternal life. Through Yahshua the Messiah, through our Lord. Through Yeshua to walk like Yeshua, we have eternal life. Amen. Right. Come on. Know you not, Don't you know, brethren, brethren, for I speak to them, speak that, know to them the that know the law, how that the law has the law dominion, dominion over a man, over man. As, long as, as long as he lives. As he lives. For the woman which has a husband, which has a husband is bound by the law to her. Husband. You're bound. The law got you bound. So long uh, as he lives. I'm telling me how much you don't like him. How much he make you sick. Mm -hmm. Time to get on sick and do what's right. Amen. Your mother, uh, sister, uh, Michelle, testimony to her, she, uh, her husband. Yes. She's bound by the law to her, her husband. husband. As long as he lives. Say, man, Mother Sylvia, she's bound by the law to her, her husband. As long as he lives. She act like that. She, she act like that man never did her wrong. Mm -hmm. Because when you're born again. Born again. Yes. Your spirit set, set you free. Amen. Amen. Just stop holding men or holding people accountable for what they did to you. That's right. You learn to be to forgive as God told you to do. Mm. Yeah. Forgive and you shall be forgiven. Amen. Uh -huh. you know, that's why with a saint don't care how wrong you're doing, they still gonna treat you right. Yes. Yeah. Amen. Amen. So we thank y'all for the words given to us this morning. Amen. Let's take what the spirit said this morning. Let's apply it to our life. Amen. If we do that, we will find peace. Oh, yeah. It's time to turn the service in the hands of the teacher to receive him by saying, Praise your way. Amen. Praise your way, saints. We thank you for the words that come forth.